so how did we meet? We should probably figure that out. Well, anyways, everybody, welcome, and if you saw episode zero, welcome back. All right, so yeah. <laughs> yeah, it's been, it's been an entire, like, year since we filmed episode zero. Oh, my God. Anyways, so yeah, you guys, uh, yeah, how did you guys meet? Because as we established, you know, you guys are a small sort of town built upon the ruins of, uh, you know, a small area in Bernori. They were all in the back line of my yoga class in the park one day, and I insisted that they come to the front. <laughs> I'm pretty sure my character was There's a line for the yoga class. class. I find it hard to look at. Here's kind of the map of where we are um, in terms of the bigger picture. I'm trying to get close to you so I can steal your yoga mat. <laughs> just the mat. Just the, just the mat. mat. <laughs> Not like your gold or anything. Just, just the mat. It's a very high value mat. It's got really pretty designs on it, you guys. <laughs> it's comfortable. I need a bed to sleep on. <laughs> so this is Bernori as a whole. You guys are kind of here. That's this map right here. And these are a bunch of craters. Oh man, we're on the exact opposite side of the mm -hmm. country. Yeah, you guys are on the exact opposite of where you were uh, when we play tested this. And here's Sanctuary, here's Canopy. Now the funny thing about Canopy is that they are a uh, city built underneath two ruined buildings, essentially. One of the buildings collapsed onto another building, so there's kind of like this canopy Sounds of... very are talking like, like, yeah, like skyscraper <laughs> buildings? Yeah, pretty much. Oh, two, oh, two skyscraper buildings. Oh, yeah, they're really tall buildings. <laughs> I no, to... I may be no physics major, but that doesn't sound like the best <laughs> place to start a city. <laughs> Probably not. Mean, I was thinking idiocracy. Oh, yeah. <laughs> All right, so yeah. Well, one of you guys um, saw on like a bulletin board or or like heard a rumor that there was a certain street nearby that was good for scavenging. We'll call it Lesser Street. Basically, a bunch of people are like, oh man, it's practically a gold mine. You know, there's a lot of department stores there. Nobody's like taken anything so far. Okay, clothes. Yeah. There's like clothes. There's pro possibly some arcane tech, which is essentially weird science. I'm not uh, familiar with weird science. There's, uh, there's, you know, some, some food. Everybody likes food, medicine. There's. So there's there's a rumor that there's like a farm pharmacy there or something. Wait, where's oh. the street? <laughs> it's it's around. It's uh, I I want to say it's within walking distance more or less. Like I'm slightly outside town limits. Yeah, I would say that it's about at most a two hour journey. Just just for walking. So are we picturing like? Chicago that's been destroyed and Sanctuary is like a couple blocks of Chicago that's been rebuilt. Yeah. So really yeah. it is Transformers. <laughs> wow. <laughs> <laughs> Alright. So that's what we're picturing. So we're in the ruins of a city. Okay. Yep, pretty much. Well, here's the thing. Sanctuary is uh, sort of built near a... like right in... right to center of Sanctuary is an old train station. So you've got train tracks moving around. Um, you've also got uh, like a ruined um, a ruined restaurant somewhere. You've got two buildings, uh, more or less. They, they were like very tall, like about eight stories and then they kind of they kind of collapsed and whatever was left was still habitable. and those kind of opened up into like, apartment buildings or a hotel or something like that basically living living areas and uh, you have a ruined train station you have various ruined buildings that people have set up shop or even just outside just out in the open people have built makeshift stands where they can sell random crap well my guy would not be in the city my guy's off off in some sort of ruins being crazy by himself so <laughs> You guys have to come find me. <laughs> Fair enough. All right, then. So we've got Joe out of the way. How do you three meet? 
I mean, I know how you two meet. Care to elaborate? <laughs> Maybe. Maybe. <laughs> Drugs. Drugs. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I'm uh, I'm his his dealer of less than legal substances. And there you have it, folks. Less than less than legal substances. <laughs> oh, I feel like my shop would probably be near the train station. Yeah, the um. I feel like train tracks would provide relatively easy. Well, here's the thing. Your uh, sort of garage, as it were, yeah. is um. You know how some gas stations will probably will, will sometimes have a garage yeah. where they can do like minor repairs or change your oil. It's kind of like that okay. nearby, and uh, the town has let you use it, but you don't really own it. Yeah, it's because like a, it's they like a lease sort of deal. Because they know that you're a dirty drug drug dealer, but you're the only one who knows how to fix things. Fix things well. So that's why they don't just outright arrest you. Yep. Instead, they have their eyes on you. They're like, let us not catch you, and we won't catch you. Yeah. Can I be a squatter in the broken building? <laughs> just a squatter? <laughs> yeah, just like, yeah. I And I, I want to investigate all the, um, I, I hear there's rumors of a pharmacy. I have to, I have to see if they have any uh, interesting wares. Is he one of your patients? Yeah. I see him for his delusions. Oh, gotcha. So you're his therapist? Yeah. Okay. I'm, every, I'm the town therapist, man. You're the town yep. therapist. Everybody <laughs> comes to me with all their feelings and their problems. And I solve them for them. What's the tree situation in town? There aren't any. <laughs> What's the tree situation just outside of town? Just outside of town. There may be a few... Brownish tree, a few dead ones. Here I am there. pulled up in a dead tree, and I've repurposed some wood for a nice platform, so I live in a tree. Okay. So, are you are you trying to like? Are uh, you a fourteen year old boy? <laughs> are you trying? <laughs> are you trying to do your best to just like regrow the the tree population? Pretty much. Town? Pretty much. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. That's also my job. I, I fix things, man. I'm like that's that's me. Well, now you two have in common, except hers is more natural. She, yours is more mechanical. She fixes people. I fix objects. <laughs> Yeah. So, okay. Wait, are plants people? Yes. Plants are people too. <laughs> I don't know. Wait, so, are people what, too. <laughs> you are eating potatoes cannibalism. It breaks my heart, but I have to do it. Okay, so how how do we meet then? We've um, got connections. I Why saw him at your store hmm. one day and I was like, You it's bad, but I'll allow it. <laughs> <laughs> I'll allow it. <laughs> So let's have your new store. He needs some more drugs. So there, he's buying drugs from you. You yeah, need something mean. repaired. Yes. I don't know. Yeah, I need uh, my bike repaired. He need the, you need a bike repaired. Okay, because I was going to say, where'd you get the money I mean, for that? Drugs don't happen during the day, man. Why not? Okay, it, it's the nighttime. She's and like, yeah, my hit... bike is broken. She <laughs> yeah. goes down the, right outside I, town I is the, walking um, her bike. I need the screws on my motorcycle helmet. I'm hanging okay. around her because I see she's got access to a lot of people, and I think they might provide me with an opportunity for some um, resources. <laughs> resources? <laughs> Human resources. If she, th if she wants to cattle, try to fix me... Which doesn't sound synonymous with human cattle. <laughs> I, I, will, I will let her try to fix me. Alright. Can and I, I can... fix her upper from Frozen be my theme song? <laughs> We're having theme songs now? No. I mean, we don't want any copyrights, right? <laughs> <laughs> so who, so who's the one who discovers that? Who's the one who gets the idea to go out? Delusions over here. <laughs> so the idea to go out. You're so, so you're the one who really wants to go out and scavenge. Yeah. So you're the one who like yes. you're the yes. one who ropes these people into uh, helping you. Mm -hmm. How do you do it? Hmm. Hey man, I got some stuff. <laughs> I got, I got, I got credits. Wait, I got, how about he still owes you money? And he's like, I don't have it now, but I can get it. Yes. <laughs> he's promising me yeah. some fine stuff from the pharmacy. Huh? Yeah. Okay. Yeah. That could be it. 
That'll work. That's... And then he tells me about it in therapy, and I have to come along because God, <laughs> these men cannot handle themselves. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so Is you're just like a tiny goblin now. Huh? Oh yeah, that's right. You're I need I need a scapegoat. <laughs> <laughs> I'll be somebody yeah, things go badly. He's small, so he's like yay big. Nice. He's, he's like tiny barely knee height. Oh, that's good to know. She she <laughs> looks like somebody who's nuts, and we can we can pin everything on her if things go bad. <sighs> so so uh, the town peacekeeper slash leader of the town. His, he's a dwarf named Jorgen Fanilo. Uh, Jorgen. He and I are very acquainted. You're very acquainted, <laughs> but he kind of gets wind that you're going with these guys, and he basically just tells you, "Yeah, keep an eye on, keep an eye on them for me. Let me know if anything shady goes on." Don't worry, buddy. I got this. Oh, well, I'm here. How are your cars doing? Oh, you're not in this conversation. Oh. <laughs> I thought she was like away from us. Oh, she's like quite a ways away, oh, but okay. like another another block away. Oh, okay. <laughs> My cars aren't doing very well. In Thank fact, God. I don't own any cars. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, I was going to say, if you had a car, it would be mine. <laughs> yeah. Or but I it. Can the get, town would probably can, be like, nope, it's ours now. <laughs> I can get a car. I know a guy. How's your car doing? The Inquisition stole it! <laughs> <laughs> Yeah. All right, so you guys uh, travel about an hour or two away from Sanctuary. You uh, find the street in question, and uh, it's it's quiet, a little a little too quiet. And then all of a sudden, you hear just some guy just burst out from like from like uh, <laughs> the city out into the city streets from like a corner behind a corner he's just like oh we got him on the run boys <laughs> <laughs> oh we got him now <laughs> hold the artillery <laughs> you have a helmet don't you <laughs> yeah okay he's got like a helmet on he's got like a sack of cans with like one in his hand he's just like yep <laughs> This guy seems like he knows what's going on. <laughs> I'm just staring wide eyed like <laughs> What? Alright, Paul, go to hell and I throw Paul at you guys. <laughs> you know, roll your throwing. Oh <laughs> uh, yeah. That's a four. I mean, who am I throwing at? I'm just, You're I'm, just randomly throwing okay. it, so like uh, he's throwing it at you. <laughs> bonks me on the head. Yeah, he just bonks you on the head. Uh, yes, roll damage. Roll, roll damage. damage for. Oh, I took improvised weapon, so it's a six. Oh, nice. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. So it's my strength plus a d6. I still get to roll the weird little random die, right? Or no? No, no, no. no? Okay, it's that's only for attack. Oh, you you roll your strength and yeah, the damage. Yeah, that's what I was rolling. Yeah, 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 yeah. So five. Okay. Cool. It just yeah, it just boink. <laughs> you're you're annoyed. That's the worst that happens to you. <laughs> okay, Paul, we'll get him again. <laughs> what are you doing out here? Don't make me send another one of my soldiers after you. Buddy. Pick up the can. <laughs> now I'm just gonna start opening the can. With what? I assume most cans have a, like that the <laughs> top you open. Oh, it's one of those soup cans. You're gonna need a can opener for that. Fingernails. Uh, use a rock. I have a knife. Yeah, you use a knife. I, a knife. I just start opening it. No, don't hurt him. <laughs> I'll do anything. Just let the soldier go. Oh, buddy, are you okay? Oh, I'm perfectly fine. My name is Ulysses MacArthur, commander of these here fine men. Okay. I see you two have something in common. Hey, what do you say? Put the knife down, buddy. He didn't do anything to you, but attack you a little bit. <laughs> I mean, it wasn't that good of attack anyway. Well, it's not good at attacking. That's why I use him first. <laughs> Shows what kind of man you are throwing oh, your crap soldiers into the line Paul of battle. Paul a chance every once in a while, and he looks vulnerable. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just going to put it in my backpack. Oh. 
You bastard. <laughs> Let my man go. <laughs> See, now we have a hostage of yours, man. Mind telling us what you're about? All right. Oh, we'll put down our arms. I'm not really about anything. I live around here. And I attack people that come into my land. <laughs> the damn Inquisition is after me, and I'm hunting them down. <laughs> Do we really look like Inquisition, bud? No. Alrighty then, <laughs> why are you attacking us if we're not Inquisition, eh? Yeah, it's pretty. It was probably Willis's idea. <laughs> it was Willis's idea. <laughs> Alright, Willis. You go, buddy. Well, I just what wanna, you guys doing? I just want to draw your attention to the pharmacy that's nearby. <laughs> I heard that way. Can I have Paul back? <laughs> if you don't throw him at me again. Okay, I won't throw Paul at you. <laughs> like a slight dent from the knife. It's okay. <laughs> We're gonna need a medic. <laughs> Pulled out a can of like man witch or something. <laughs> <laughs> uh, all right, Ulysses. We're heading to the pharmacy. Do you want to come along? You well, the pharmacy. Out? Yeah, I'll come with. Maybe we can get you some new cans, pal. Cool. Well, while new they're cans. distracted, I'm going to sneak Don't off to the pharmacy. Oh, is it close by? Oh yeah, it's close by. Uh, roll your stealth, and everybody else, roll your notice. What is notice if I don't have it? <laughs> if you don't have a skill on notice, it's a D4 Smart. minus 2. Nice. Oh, you get the D6 too, but you minus 2 from that. 2. 2. So, two. so far you need to be a oh. 2. And D4. You just, you're just minusing 2 from both. 3! <laughs> hey, you got a 4, so re-roll that. You got 3. <laughs> I got 3. Alright, you guys need to roll off then. Because he got a three as well. He also got a three. Yeah. Okay. The three the three of you guys. <laughs> See what so I did there? I didn't do anything really, but whatever. <laughs> jokes. Yeah, we re-roll our skill and it's just... Oh. Four. I gotta re-roll that. So you, got a, you got a seven. No, I re-rolled. Oh. I got a five. You got a five. He managed to get a seven. He meant okay, so both of you guys notice him just trying to sneak off by himself. <laughs> Where do you think you're going, short stack? Well, I wanted to go over to this pharmacy over here. Oh I my thought god, you... it's like a little green teddy bear! <laughs> hey, uh, hey! <laughs> <laughs> he probably could, he can't weigh that much. <laughs> Although, do you have the thief edge? I just want to point that out. Do I? Uh, yes, yeah. I do. <laughs> then you get plus two to you. Oh, well, then I'm at six. Then oh, you man. don't notice him, but you do. <laughs> but you're still just yeah. like, hey, so we're doing teddy bear. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. And I run after you. <laughs> By the way, I don't think we mentioned it in episode zero, but we have three humans and a goblin in our party. <laughs> <laughs> and he's a small goblin. Yeah, he's a small <laughs> goblin. <laughs> Don't throw me. <laughs> we'll airbag you. It's okay. We'll uh, I won't throw you. I set you down. Gently. Gently. Ask one ugly teddy bear. <laughs> I, I don't know if you would buy that. Right, buddy. <laughs> okay. okay. We we'll hear you. So wait, your name is Paul? No! His name is Paul. <laughs> My name's Ulysses. Ulysses MacArthur, commander of these here fine young gentlemen. <laughs> I think he's missing a few bolts. I ain't missing any bolts. I think we should send him <laughs> ahead and see if anything happens to him. I think that's a good idea. You want to send me to the pharmacy? <laughs> well, I won't go alone. I'll have all my men with me. Nothing can stop us. All right, but I'm going in the pharmacy. <laughs> all right. I'll follow behind. Yeah, I'll come too. Like, like, you go, like, 10 feet. <laughs> <laughs> well, if everyone's going, then I'm, I'm not letting you take my, my, um... We are what, by your drugs? Y you mean my, my loot? <laughs> you have a tab. Some of it's mine. Yeah, if you cover your tab. Just think about what we talked about. Is this going to be good for you? 
Is it going to enrich your life some? I didn't think so, but I'll allow it. These are trying times. All right, so you all go into the pharmacy. Yet, <laughs> I'm in the pharmacy. Forest You're in the pharmacy. painting, <laughs> earth loving hippies. <laughs> You know, that would actually make sense. That does make sense. Yeah. I was going with it, man. Yeah. Are so you in the pharmacy yet? Yeah, I'm following you. Nice. Okay. So all four of you are in the pharmacy? Yep. Cool. You walk inside the pharmacy, and uh, it's empty. Relatively. There may be, like, a few bottles here and there, but it's not... It's not what everybody was saying it was. It wasn't as good as everybody was saying it was. Wait, why were we going to come to the pharmacy? Drugs. There was, there was something magical there. Oh, there's nothing in the pharmacy. I've been here a lot of times. Crack. <laughs> <laughs> Four of you guys just go straight through this hole in the floor <laughs> as the floor just, like, oh, doesn't really open up. It just kind of breaks away from you guys. Your combined weight just... You know, causes causes everything to become unstable, and you end up falling through the floor down what looks to be a tunnel, going straight down. It's weird, but it's there. <laughs> Damn it, Odium! I told you you were putting on weight. Send drugs. <laughs> I'm so like the smallest one of the group. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> yeah. Well, anyways, I need everybody to make an agility roll. Six. Four is my highest. Fifteen. Three. Three. You take eight points of damage. Bet. I just parkour yeah, like shaking. all the way down. All right, cool. Let me just get that out of the way. And I do a little flip. You guys end up in what appears to be a uh, cavern at the bottom of this sort of tunnel. And uh, you see in front of you guys about about uh, six goblins. Hey, brothers. But they're kind of way underdressed compared to you. And uh, they're, like, many of them have, like, knives. And they look, they look rather... Happy to see you guys, but in, in you know, a kind of we want to kill you kind of way. These are... Can you roll your smarts for me? This would be something that you would know because you're a goblin. Three. Three. Apparently you wouldn't know. So you wouldn't goblin. know. <laughs> <laughs> which, kind of makes, which kind of makes sense because, you know, after the wither root, you just kind of... Uh, <laughs> But yeah, these are these these goblins. Imagine, if you will, kind of the Neanderthal equivalent of goblins. It's like you have the goblins that you guys are used to, kind of uh, the civilized goblins, uh, and then you have these guys who look almost animalistic, almost like Smeagol in a sense. Uh, but yeah, they're 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 kind of there, and then you're kind of in front of them, and then. They charge at you! So place your guys somewhere around here. Shooty McShooterson, who doesn't actually have a gun. No, I'm, I'm down. <laughs> I, didn't, down. I didn't make the agility roll. <laughs> <laughs> oh, yeah. Ouch. Yeah, you are shaken. Down um, the shaken and prone would make sense. Yeah, we'll, we'll say that. Put that next to your character to <laughs> indicate that he is shaken. There are, I will remind you guys, there are only two Jokers in this deck. We are not using Jokers Wild. Instead, we are using uh, the Benny system, where if you use a Benny, I get that Benny, and if I use a Benny, I give that to you. And uh, if you guys are good with your role-playing, I'll just give you a Benny to keep. All right. So, this will be mine. This will be yours. And I get a Joker right off the bat. Of course. Rigged. Rigged. King. Yes. Four. <laughs> I don't go last. Yeah, I do. You know what? 
Joe, I'll give you a bunny for nice. your intro. <laughs> so, I can choose to go first. And uh, Joe has a king, so I would have to roll my agility against your agility. Okay, so Joe, I'm going to need to roll my agility against your agility. This is going to be a group roll, so all of them combined make one roll with a wild die. Alright. And I get plus two because I have a joker. No, I don't like it. <laughs> <laughs> well. Oh, yes, yes. And they got a three. I'm going to Benny that. <laughs> I'm collecting these. Yeah, Reroll the six. Yeah, I was just so I got an eight. Plus seven, 15. Nine. Boom. Dang it. Actually, it'd be a 17 because of the plus I guess two. I got the Benny. Though. That was nice. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. All right. So this guy right here is just going to move in and try and uh, try and attack you first. I'm prone and shaken. I like these old minis. All right, d6 fighting, and he gets a nat one on that. Hey! <laughs> and he'll miss. It's still miss. <laughs> <laughs> but at least he didn't get a nat one. Um, this guy is also going to move next to you and try and attack you. Three that'll because hit. of gang up bonus, and that'll still miss. No, you Joker. That's a hit. Oh, yeah. Yeah, you're right. What, the Joker adds to the whole time? Yep. That's oh! true to everything. It's including damage. Including damage, yeah. That is a nasty card. Yeah. Mm -hmm. What is their strength? So the fact that he got it on me when I'm right in front of the is going to hurt. I've never understood why the horse is the Joker in some card decks. Like, Have horses you ever aren't seen funny. Mr. Ed? I guess. <laughs> that peanut butter. <laughs> that peanut butter. <laughs> Just put voiceovers. <laughs> yep. Red and green. Merry Christmas, everybody. You take two, two points of damage. Four points. Well, yeah, four points. That's not enough to go through my toughness. So. Yep. Uh, this guy will then move up to you as well. Uh, it's an onslaught. That'll hit. That will hit. Uh, five okay. points of damage. Okay. Seven points of damage. Roll the four. <laughs> Eleven. Ah, Fifteen. Christ. Ah, Nineteen. <laughs> Merry Christmas, indeed. My God. Stop! <laughs> You're just gonna kill me. <laughs> <laughs> what is this? Oh, oh my God. Ah, Twenty-seven. <laughs> that guy is loaded. Twenty-nine. <laughs> He fires around. Yes. <laughs> Except it's a knife, so he's just like stabbing That's with the true. Throat. Yeah. He's literally straight through your throat and he just brings it out. He's he like, goes right now. <laughs> 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 oh, Jesus. Oh, That's five wounds. I can't heal him at that point, can I? Uh, uh, not I really. He's going to soak it. Yeah. Remember, you only need a three. To not be dying. Yeah, is it, is it a, a four to... The fourth one is you're dying. So, so he needs to get an eight. I need to get rid roll. of two of them in order to not be dying. Best of luck. That's one. I'll try again. Another one. Yep. Yeah, he's just bennying it up this time. Right out of the bat. Oh nice. dang! He's got his. He's got two sixes. Okay, I get rid of two wounds, so I'm at three wounds. Sweet. I just got a goblin knife through my throat. I might have sepsis. So I'll put that die right next to you to yep. let you know how many wounds you have. So this guy right here is going to move against you, and he is. Got a five, seven, seven, seven. seven. Does What's that hit your, you? Um, your parry number. Seven. Parry number is seven. So he hits you. So he hits you. Wait, uh, no, 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 no. Plus one. Oh wait, I think I have to have my shield equipped. Yeah. Yep. Do you have it up? Yeah. What's your fighting die? Okay. Your fighting die is a d10. 
I'm, oh, a, I'm like a ninja, man. Dang. Because if you're if your shield if you got your shield out yes. and at the ready, then he misses. Okay. Because that'll give you effectively eight to your parry. And then reaction. If you had it equipped, yeah. This one right here is going to uh, take a swipe at you as well. Funny enough, all of them are using knives. <laughs> <laughs> one so, knife is a, almost enough to kill me. That's a five, so that will not go through your parry. All right, and that is the end of the goblin's turn. <coughs> You're up. This goblin. I'm going to shoe stat him. I'm whipping out my guns. Nice. And, um... I mean, I want to throw soup cans at him, but I'll use the <laughs> I'll use the rifle right now. Mm, do what your character would do. <laughs> uh. Puts his hand behind him, thinks about it, decides to pull out his gun. <laughs> <laughs> uh, yeah, I'll, I'll shoot him. Okay. I got him this time, boys! Which one are you shooting at? <laughs> I'm shooting at this one. Oh, wait, no. I'll shoot at one of the guys attacking you. Which is the one that, uh, this guy, did you just completely, uh... No, it was this, this one that nearly killed me in one hit. Yeah, that guy almost right. killed him. I'll do him then. Do, 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 do. It's fighting as the... No, shooting. Or shooting? Or I yep, guess it's so whatever your shooting does. Four. Four, that'll hit. Yes! And then two, three, eight. Uh, Ooh, roll that. That's an eight. And a seven. Fifteen. 16. 16. Nice. He dies. You pull out your rifle. You uh, you cock it. You aim it. And then, blam! He turns into green paste. <laughs> I'm sorry, Teddy Bear, but you're attacking one of my own. <laughs> <laughs> Alright. Joe's done. Andy, you and Odium are up. No, I don't get any sort of advantage from attacking him behind. From behind, do I? Since he's prone right now, uh, yeah, you, you don't get any bonus from that. But if he was up, you would get a gang up bonus. Is it four wounds and you die? Four wounds when you, and you're dying. Okay, but if I attacked over here, I would get a gang up bonus. Not yep. Dead if, if you get rid of your two wounds, are you still shaken? Yes. Okay. Okay. As a spirit roll. Um, the only, like if you're if you make a soak roll, um, if you negate all of the wounds that you took from that single attack, then you don't become shaken. Oh, but if okay. you still take wounds, then you're shaken. Okay. I'm gonna attack with my rapier. Gotcha. All right. Reroll the six. That's an ace. Eight. Eight. Okay, that's a hit. Roll your damage now. So that will be your strength and your d4 for your rapier. So, seven. All right. You thrust at him with your rapier, and uh, you kind of poke him in the shoulder, but he's still up. It wasn't any artery or vital organ. He's only shaken. Shish kebabs, anyone? Damn. And, uh... These goblins are tough. <laughs> and, Joe, if, uh, somebody takes... If somebody is shaken twice, then they take a wound from that. Oh, okay. Yeah, so if you're unshaken, it's an extra four to start taking the wounds. But if you're already shaken, it's just above your top. I cannot okay. heal and hit someone at the same turn, right? No. Right. Okay. So well, you could... But you'd be taking a minus minus two multi-action penalty. Nah. To both actions. Nah. I will try and heal Ben. All right. Who's Ben? Er, Johnson. I will heal Johnson. Okay. You do have to be right next to him oh, yeah. in order to do that. Yeah, because you yeah. don't have ranged healing abilities. And if you move, then these two will get attacks of opportunity against you. Fair enough. Uh, okay. One's only one. The one's shaken. Ah, yeah, you are right. So you don't have to be taking one to do that. And he will crit fail. Um, if you want, you can attack him for free. I don't have a gun. Oh, she, has, she has a sword. You oh, can attack no, him I for, have a whip. You, you have can whip. attack him for free without needing, uh, without taking a minus two multi-action penalty. Okay, so I'll do that. Yeah, yeah, mm -hmm. okay. I can attack him. Okay. 
So, yeah, she, she's essentially getting an attack of opportunity because he uh, crit failed his attack of opportunity. So I would roll my fighting die. I love it when people do yep. that. <laughs> it's just a chain <laughs> miss up. Nine. Wow. Uh, that is, is a, a raise. For you. Yeah, so you're looking at, what's your strength? Six. So a D6 four. and a D4 and an extra D6 because, uh, because you got a raise on that roll. Uh, eight. So, eight. Eight. Uh, yeah, you. He he tries to stab you with with his knife, and I take it and I just crack him upside the head. <laughs> yeah, you just you just completely counterattack with him and stab him with his own knife, like right in the head, <laughs> nice. and he dies. And uh, now make your spell casting roll to heal Johnson. Your spell casting is what D six. Yeah. Oh, nice. Eight. So you heal two wounds. Okay. Two wounds. And while I'm healing the wounds, because I heal in a light burst, I'm pointing my hand at him and just muttering to myself gleefully, The Lord of Light blesses you, my son. <laughs> <laughs> so that's your turn. Next Go up is Johnson. Mm -hmm. Oh, I forgot. Uh... <laughs> yep. Yeah, make a spirit Did roll, add plus yet? one to it because. Or minus one because I've got the wound. So it's a straight up roll. Yeah, it's just a straight roll. Five. Five. You are unshaken. Ooh, I can do stuff. So you can get up and try and counterattack these guys. Um, If I shot the goblin from here. With a pistol? No, I have a shotgun. Oh, with your shotguns. Um, yeah, uh, in Savage Worlds, the only ranged weapon you can attack with at close right. range is a pistol or something the size of a pistol. <coughs> and that's why All right, then, uh... <laughs> that's why, that's why, uh, Ulysses MacArthur has a bayonet. <laughs> and suitcase. <laughs> nice. Um, what are you trying to do? I gotta try and throw a stun right here. Okay. Uh, you would be caught in the blast, though. That's fine. Okay. I'm just going to pull it out and just shoot the ground right in front of me, basically. All right. So, yeah, you get back up, and you take out your grenade launcher, you fire at the ground with a, with, with a, with a recently placed uh, stun grenade. Yep. So on a raise, I believe it's the bigger roll at minus two to avoid becoming stunned. Yeah, must make bigger rolls at minus two. All right. And they both fail. I'm fine. All right, so both of these guys are shaken now. Actually, all the go all the feral goblins are shaken right now. One is uh, one is tending to her wounds. The other two are stunned because they're like, "What kind of magic is this?" <laughs> oh my God, the daddy stuck. <laughs> all right, hand in your cards, and we will begin round two. Round two, Badu. <laughs> Fight! I got a five. Uh, Odium got an eight. Johnson a nine, MacArthur a jack, and Jane, Jane a ten. Sweet. So, That's right, Jane's a ten. Commander MacArthur, it is your turn. <laughs> <laughs> well, I'm going to shoot these guys again. All right. Wait, you know, I'm not going to be selfish. My men need a turn. <laughs> All right. How about them? <laughs> I call on Jameson. <laughs> And I'll be throwing a soup can at this one. All right. <laughs> Roll your throwing. There's a good chance you could actually kill him. Yeah? Yeah. Because they're all shaken. So. Yeah. You... For damage, you just need a four or higher. <laughs> oh, a double one. <laughs> Wait, can I Benny out of it? You can Benny yeah, out of oh, it. Oh, give me that. <laughs> I was going to say, maybe the can just explodes in your hand. <laughs> oh! <laughs> oh! This is insane! <laughs> Boom! <laughs> Hey, Sweet, that's a six. Go. We rolled a six. Wait, all I needed was a four, right? To hit yeah, but we rolled a six. You might raise. 
You do, 10. <gasps> uh, I said 4 for damage, not for no, attack. Oh, you okay. got a 10 for his so attack. Ten. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. It's a ranged attack, so... Yeah, that is that is a raise, I believe. Yeah, that's a raise. So that's an extra d6? Yeah. Extra d6. That's <laughs> so, an improvised weapon. So you're essentially rolling 3d6, I believe. Yes, I am. <laughs> 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 so, well, 12. so 12 points of damage. <laughs> With a super game. <laughs> you throw Jameson at this feral goblin, and as she's like tending to her wound, bonk, it just bounces off of her head and she just plops down on the ground. Yes. Oh my gosh. <laughs> <laughs> All right, and next up is Jane. All right, so. I'm going to move one, two, three, four right here. Okay. And then take a swing at that one. With your whip? Yep. You have reach with that. You don't have to be right next to him. I know. Alright, so. Six. Seven. Alright. So that will hit. Okay. Roll your damage. Six. Seven? No, wait. Ten? Ten? Yeah. Um, you lash out with your whip, and the whip kind of wraps around the feral goblin's neck. And I and, yank it. And you yank it, and he just falls to the ground with a broken neck. <laughs> Savage. <laughs> Savage worlds, after all. Savage worlds, worlds yeah. <laughs> all, right, all right, Johnson. I'm going to... Smack this goblin with the butt of my launcher. All right. Six. Eleven for the fighting roll. Eleven for the fighting roll. Now you're looking at your strength plus a d4 because it is a, an improvised weapon. Okay. No, nothing for raising though. What was the what was the attack roll again? Eleven. Eleven. Yeah. No, that's a raise. All right. Extra d6. Eight, eleven, fourteen. Fourteen, and you deal the final killing blow against the goblin who tried to have you dead. No, nope, he got that one. <laughs> well, against one of three <laughs> goblins who tried to have you dead. Yep. Congratulations, guys. First round of combat over, but now you're stuck in a cave. It looks like you have, you have a clear way out here, but you have... A smaller tunnel here. Who has the who has the highest smarts? That'd be me. D6. I have a D eight. Yeah. Make a smarts roll. A straight smarts roll. All right. Eleven. Nope. Ten. Ten. All right. Wounded. You assume. You assume that those feral goblins may have come from this smaller tunnel. Um, but then that also raises a bigger question. Where do these tunnels come from? Are we going to fit through the tunnels? If goblins came from them. Well, I mean, Odium could fit through this one. But all of you guys can fit through this one. Straight ahead. Hmm. Well, I think that the goblins probably came from that tunnel. It's a bit small for the likes of us. Well, you could go out and explore if you want. Hmm. Yeah, there's I no way could. we're 50 plus men through there. <laughs> no way. It's a small hole. I don't think 50 men can fit. Nope, nope. I'm going to poke my head in and, and see if I can see anything. Alright. Uh, you just pretty much see straight up blackness on the head. Well, it's good because I have infravision. Yeah, you don't really see any uh, living living persons up ahead, so you still only see... Well, this time it would just be redness. <laughs> oh, and also, since all of you guys are humans, it's... Well, it's pretty dim in here, I guess, but it's, it's going to be fairly dark throughout this cavern. You're kind of fine. Um, you take a minus one penalty. The rest of you guys have minus two penalties. But you're kind of fine here, because there's light... Shining from uh, where you where you fell. Granted, I saw golden halos. 
I'm gonna move over here. I'm gonna be injecting something. All right. Um. <laughs> so it's a miracle elixir. Okay, you're injecting miracle but elixir. I don't know if they know that. Okay. Because my my elixirs aren't in like standard bottles or anything like that. Okay, gotcha. I made them. <laughs> They're special. He's injecting himself with a special super serum. <laughs> Take that how you will. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, do you even notice this? I Are notice, but I don't say anything. I don't notice because I'm sticking my head through. <laughs> I think through I'm thinking hole. about yes. I'm I'm thinking about poking on ahead and seeing if I see anything. I don't notice because I currently have a stack of soup cans in front of me, and I have a stick, and I'm putting battle plans and talking to the group of them. <laughs> <laughs> All right, men. There's only one way out of here. It's this way. <laughs> I don't know. I, I think I heard one of those goblins mention something about treasure. I'm gonna go ahead and and see if I can see any. Um, I forgot the exact number, but I want to say like one one story maybe. I mean, you took three d six damage. Uh, however that translates into Savage Worlds, I don't remember in terms of falling damage. But it was... Probably somewhere around one or But it, it's too it's too high for you to really climb out. Yeah. I mean, it would take you a while and you need climbing gear, some rope. Can yeah. we throw him Oh, I can climb out. <laughs> he could probably climb out. Any <laughs> <laughs> of you got some bright ideas? All right, men, I have a plan of attack. We go that way. <laughs> and I point to the large tunnel. <laughs> All right. That's a solid plan. Yep, solid yep, plan. came up yep. with it myself. Congratulations. You're sure? asking really brother Tom, you. a skilled commander. But are you sure? I swear I heard them talk about treasure. I kind of want to look ahead. Not everything in life is about treasure. Exactly. Some things are about kinship and brotherhood and the bond of manly men. <laughs> Uh, excuse you, I'm a woman. <laughs> Just saying. You're still out in my... platoon? <laughs> Good, because I'm coming anyway. You can heal people. Nurses do that. <laughs> you know, I just walk ahead muttering something I sexist garbage. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, so you guys move forward into the larger tunnel. And it's, it's a fairly long tunnel. I'd say it's about 2, 4, 6, 8, 10, 50 feet ahead. Um, you see sort of a, sort of a fork. You see, um, you see the pathway still go ahead, but there's a, a turn to the left in front of you. And that goes down a tunnel as well. Can somebody make me a notice roll? Not ice in the fly. <laughs> you don't know. My cat doesn't notice much. <laughs> Five. Five. Oh wait, minus two. This. Uh, four. This is a scene thing. Uh, yeah, this is this is a scene. So three. So four. Four. Okay, cool. Um. Well, believe it or not, you actually do see something. You see a light ahead. Sweet. Uh, you see a light ahead. You see the outline of a figure ahead, and it seems like this tunnel, le this tunnel that um, kind of branches off to the left of you guys, it leads to another chamber with, you know, maybe a way out. Okay. So, oh, what's this left, right? Are you blind down yep. here? So. Yep. Are you blind down in here? the time that I've been walking in the tunnel, I've gathered, you know, my whip up by my side into a small thing, and I'm going to walk towards the light, muttering at my whip named Taka. Taka. All right, Taka, let's see if we can go find some people who appreciate us for, you know, fighters instead of just someone who can heal people <laughs> who's good at being a girl. <laughs> we don't need these men. Taka responds to you, that Willis guy was kind of handsome. 
We don't need no man. <laughs> I need some doctors. I thought us. you were supposed to help them with their problems. <laughs> I thought he was insane and he was on drugs. <laughs> hey, uh, anthropomorphizing things. Oh yeah, the cork, cork hindrance. Mm -hmm. I didn't say I had all my marbles. <laughs> Have a Benny. <laughs> Only sane person here. <laughs> Wait, who said I was insane? Nobody, bud. Was it Paul? Was He's it always Paul? slandering me to the other man. <laughs> I mean, he, he really enjoyed his time in the dark bag. Oh, man, Paul. <laughs> All right. So you guys are just kind of bickering at, um, in front of this tunnel. Did you, I where did see you go? someone up there. Towards oh, the well. Okay. Like, I'm kind of, like, a couple steps ahead of them. She's I don't know if you should go up there. I think it might be the Inquisition. <laughs> <laughs> Me and Taka are going. You can take it or leave it. Taka it or leave well, it. <laughs> fine, I will... I Wait, will did he say the Inquisition is ahead? <laughs> <laughs> no. Full speed ahead, man! Full <laughs> speed, man! <laughs> and I start running up <laughs> to the left towards where I think the Inquisition is. All right. <laughs> and I lurk, I lurk slowly behind in the shadows. All right, you go up ahead, and uh, you see, sort of engulfed in light. There's, there's almost the same situation as last time. There's kind of a tunnel leading upwards, and you see, sort of at the bottom, engulfed in light, um, a corpse with, like, a sword sticking out of it. So imagine, if you will, somebody falling a great, great height, and then they accidentally fall on their sword. Ooh. So the blade is kind like of, like, fun. up. How much is that sword worth? And low. How much Upon is that sword worth? Make a notice light, roll. A holy chorus. <laughs> and I say, have at thee! And I am currently beating up a body. <laughs> Four. And I'm are, are, are we in the light? <laughs> You're good. You're good. I'll give it to you. Um, it's a very fancy looking sword. You can't tell whether or not it's magical, but it does look expensive. Excalibur! <laughs> <laughs> oh, I think... I'm gonna look to see if he's act if I could still alive. I mean, I'm still beating up the sky. I'm I'm going to take the sword. <laughs> All right. If it's if it's cursed, will I be cursed? <laughs> Um, cursed weapons are... Or, or do I have to use it? Well, cursed weapons, a lot of them, you can't get rid of them unless if you use the dispel spell on yourself. <laughs> but that's another can of worms. You just, you just pick up the sword. It's, um, it's a short sword. You can barely, like, So, um, if Han Hanson, you want to give him, like, ye old lists of items... Uh, he can write that down in his inventory. And I'm looking at him, pulling out the short sword, going, Hey, short sword for a shorty. <laughs> Fits. That's racist. <laughs> well, anyways, there is a, uh, there's a tremor that happens. Um, actually, quite a few tremors. The whole, the whole, like, area begins to shake, and, uh, the way in all of a sudden becomes barred to you as, like, rubble drops down to the ground. You could probably be able to, um... Four weight, that's strength plus d6. You could probably be able to, uh, clear it out. Um, and just, like, move the rubble aside, but you're kind of trapped in here. And we now have... We're not necessarily in combat, but you guys have two rounds to act. It sounds like the Earth is hungry right now. We're all hungry, buddy. <laughs> we'll say that these are the rocks you gotta get past. Ooh, can I climb over the rocks? Uh, make a notice roll. I know, there's a lot of notice rolls in this session, but... Am I in delight? Um, I mean, no, you got it. You're, uh, you, you can, you look at the, the rubble, and it doesn't look like there's a big enough hole for you to fit. Maybe if you, like, try and dig your, dig your way out a little bit, you could get out. But, it's actually Jane's turn to act right now. Right. So, what are you, Wait, so what are you What doing? is the exact, is the, so the, that caved in on us. Is the rest of the room caving? It's still trem tremoring right now or no? Um, 
The the trembling is kind of quieting down. But um you can you can also well give me a notice roll. This one will be for listen, so don't apply any what minuses. Is notice or governed by smarts. Yay. Seven. Seven. Well, you do get your wild die as well. It's just that's also a minus two. But um, yeah, you uh, you hear movement. You hear the rustling of movement. The tremor. The tremors are starting to die down, but you do hear a rustling of movement, sort of beneath the earth or around you, like with within the earth, if you will. All right. Right. So. <clears throat> I say we work our way through. What better way to work through our feeling of burden than to lift out these rocks out of the way? I agree. You should work on the rocks. Well, it I sounds like the whole place is still it's trembling. Now we can get there too fast enough. I am short and not that strong, so that doesn't mean you can't help. We're I all a team. I can. Teamwork makes the dream work, Odium. Even the mighty <laughs> boulder was a pebble once. Indeed. What he said. So you can deal with the pebbles, Pebble. Yes, I, w I will uh, move these pebbles. Okay. So, uh, you do have, like, it, it is almost like a combat round. It is a combat round, essentially, yeah. except mm -hmm. you're not fighting something. Right. So, you to do an so you'll probably, like, move up. Okay. And then try and do something. So, uh, can I just, like, kind of scale it and get to the top and start, like, pulling a boulder down? Alright, uh, give me a climb check. Oh, that's about four. Yeah, I don't have climbing. Okay. Three. Yeah, you're unable to scale up from where you are. You, you just kind of, like, place a few hands on the rock and you think you got a grip, but you're like, ugh, 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 and just kind of struggle to Basically even get off the ground. In real life. Um, so, can I just start, like, tugging yeah. at that point, then? Make, yeah. a, make a strength check. Four. Four. Cool. You've got one one boulder lifted and pushed out of the way. Okay. Um, yeah, you, you start like you know, clearing out some of the some of the rocks. You think that if you have help, eventually you'll be able to get all this away, but you're making good progress. Okay. So I take the big boulder and I go, Sexism! There you go. And then I start <laughs> digging and I'm like, think I'm just a nurse <laughs> <laughs> just muttering. Alright. Um, Commander, it's your turn. Are you sure we should be digging at the tunnel over there? I'm sure. Get your ass over here. <laughs> Is there another way out? You know, there is an ancient problem. Yeah, isn't there a um, hole in the ceiling? None of us can climb. Sometimes I can climb. <laughs> I'm kind of curious what's up there. Can, if I make a notice check is that to see if there's another way out, is that going to take up my action? No. That'll be a free action. All right, you I'll do, do that. that. Wait, what is notice again? Smarts? Uh, notice is a skill. If you don't have it, then yeah, it's a... D4, right? yeah, yeah, minus two. So you just take a minus two off of whatever you are. All right, roll, roll the four. That's an ace. Uh-huh. <laughs> a one. So three, three. in total. Yeah. Yeah, you're you're still just kind of uh, you know up in the clouds, as it were. You're kind of looking around, and you're just like, "Where are, are we inside? Are, are we back at base ten? I think that was an underground complex. Did I find it finally?" <laughs> and I just yell at him, "Johnson, help me!" <laughs> no, you're not. You're not Johnson. You're oh, yeah, help I'm kind of you. He's my Arthur. <laughs> I'll come help. Go to work, nurse! I'll help you out! <laughs> you know, maybe one Hold day... Hold up my whip like I'm gonna... I'm thinking about it, and I'm like... Can't! 
He's you a know, friend, not I a foe. I still can't shake the feeling that this isn't the right way out. I was once told that the most direct way isn't always the right way. But I'm still going to move this boulder, so... <laughs> All right. Uh, you can make a strength check to help him. Basically, every success mm -hmm. that you get is a plus one to his roll. Yeah, six. Three. Nine. All right. So that's a plus two to your roll. Nice. <gasps> you're welcome. I rolled two at the same time. That's awkward. Okay. Well, yeah, no, that's what you're supposed to do. You always get the wild I mean, like, I rolled the, a wild one. That's fine. So you got nine because so of her plus two. Nice. All right, nice. Uh, the both of you are able to clear out enough of the rocks to where this guy could probably climb out, and uh, one of you guys could probably take a full action to climb out. So I just look over the boulder and at him and go, yeah, you're welcome. Nurse Jane, <laughs> out! <laughs> so drop it. <laughs> yeah, I think you should drop it, because I don't think he's going to get it. <laughs> <laughs> I say, Yes! Out. <laughs> <laughs> well, I guess I will go ahead and try to squeeze through. <laughs> All right. Uh, give me a climb check. Seven. Yep, you make it outside. Woo! It's nice and windy out here. <laughs> In the underground tunnel. Yes. <laughs> All right, Odium. I didn't say I was bright. <laughs> I'm going to... Nice and windy, because that's what we're the road goes to your system. <laughs> I'm going to activate my harness. Okay. Let's just see if I can raise... No, it's just a regular activation. Okay. And then I will move next and assist, but not like... My action is activating it. All right, so you activate the flash harness, and then you just like <laughs> right over there, yep. just like rapid firing rocks out of the way, maybe. Not yet. Not I yet. Just get there. Okay, you just get there because okay. the action is activating the harness. Okay, gotcha. All right. Well, you guys. Um, all, all of a sudden, the rustling gets louder, and uh, all of a sudden, out of some uh, tiny little holes. Pop out a little swarm of rats, and they're kind of agitated. All right, so Jane, you are up. Okay. Will you try to squeeze out or uh, try and pick up more rocks? Uh, I'm gonna try and squeeze out, and I'll just shriek while I'm doing it because rats. <laughs> All right, give me a climb check. Two or no one. Uh, that's gonna be nothing. You're, you you right. you try to fit through, but apparently you needed to clear out just a little bit more. <laughs> God, I'm too fat. <laughs> All right. Do I know there's rats? Probably not. You know? Yeah. He, he just hears me screaming, <laughs> and that's it. I, I assume that she got stuck because she's she's too fat for eating all that nature food. <laughs> yes, that's, that's a large. I call them down, Nurse Jane. They're just rats. Let the men take care of this. <laughs> <laughs> you shut them all up. There's rats. So these rats are going to just engulf the two of you, oh, and God. they are going to uh, they're they're going to start biting you guys. Yes, it tickles, but in a bad way. <laughs> <laughs> so Johnson, you take. <laughs> oh, you gotta stop using that one, man. And then ah! fifteen. <laughs> All right, I'll use this one. Sixteen points of damage to you. <laughs> Please no, not death by rats. And uh, four to you. Right, four. four to MacArthur. <laughs> okay. So if I have a toughness of five, it doesn't. Nope. Nope. Do it doesn't do anything to you. you. Still getting used to this no HP lifestyle. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Actually, it does. No, it doesn't. Wait. What is your toughness without armor? Five. Oh wait a second. So I here's been adding my armor. So yeah, my toughness without armor is five. Okay. Surprise. Right. Really add that well, armor. even with a four, even with a four, you're good. Because the funny thing about rats is, uh, 
They deal damage to the least armored location. Ah. Yeah. yeah. Oh. Well, oh, bastards. Wait, to the least armored location? Least armored location. Then it's two, not one. Oof. Yeah, that's 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 gonna smart. Alright, so you Jeez, guys got you guys got rats in here now. I hear Johnson. lots of screaming. <laughs> Johnson, deal with them. <laughs> uh, I'm going to screaming, and neither of it is for them. How many pain pills is it? Um, so my free action. I'm going to chug some pain pills. All right. Uh, I'm going to pop four of them. Four Heavy of duty. them. So I need to make. Okay, so I ignore two wound penalties, and then I need to make a bigger roll at plus two to avoid becoming addicted. Yes. Okay, I'm not addicted. Okay. I currently ignore my wound penalties. All right. So, what is your action? Uh, well, I'm gonna move away from the rats. Okay. I'm gonna move. I'm gonna move over here. They do get an AOL yeah. on you. Yeah. I'm not gonna use the red die this time. <laughs> Ah! <laughs> that's uh, that's that's seven. <laughs> Ten. <laughs> He's trying to kill you. <laughs> um, uh, shoot the uh, the bloody things. All right. But they're not bloody yet. It's with a. I have shotgun? a shotgun, so it's a spread weapon. Ah, In guy direction. <laughs> yeah. Am I gonna be okay? <laughs> You'll be fine. Okay. I got a. Five, I ignore two. You so had four. all those injuries before the war. All right, <laughs> all right. You got your to hit. Roll your damage. So seven. Okay, thirteen. Uh, seventeen. All right. Um, you unload your shotgun into these things, and the majority of them die, and the rest just. Run away and scatter. All right. Good job, Johnson. That's and a true soldier right second, there. <laughs> my second action because of quickness. I'm gonna go and clear more rubble. All right. Make a strength check. Um, you two also make strength checks to help him if you would like. Three. A four. Okay. Kay. So it's just my roll then because I've currently got a minus one. Okay. So you got a six on the die, another 12, six. Uh, 16. 16, all right. Um, the lightning speed, it just Yeah, he vanishes. just, he, he, you all, this, you see him just get covered in rats, then he just runs away, just, and then just uh, rapid fires rocks away uh, to the point where yeah, you guys, you guys can have an easier time of getting out now. Uh, now that's the kind of man you want in your company. <laughs> I, I just follow him, muttering, "Man, what's in those goddamn pills?" <laughs> <laughs> yeah, because I'm also moving super fast. All this, all this, I hope all over some a bunch of reds. I hope you guys kept one of them. I, I need a pet. <laughs> <laughs> all right. So, uh, MacArthur, it's your turn. Uh, is there enough room for us all to get through now, or do we still need to continue to... For at least one of you guys. I will move boulders, because MacArthur does not leave his men behind. <laughs> all right. Make your strength check. Five. Here, I'll assist. All right. Yeah, I got nothing. And you? Five. Five. All right. So, yeah, now, now you've, um... Now you've cleared up enough of the boulders for all three of you guys to uh, go through. Yes. Without needing to make any checks of any kind. Yay. And, uh, Odium, what are you doing at this point? Um, I'm just looking ahead. I'm waiting to see what all this noise was. Yet. Yeah, I don't think we've moved through yet, but... All right. So, everybody hand in your cards. That was hoarding cards. Yeah. <laughs> nice. I can tell. <laughs> All right. I think that was from a few turns ago. <laughs> Last combat with the goblin. Yeah. <laughs> and 
Jane goes first. Yay! Um, but yeah, before this round begins, this entire template, rats. <laughs> <laughs> they're they're all piling in now. Let me just put one here just to just to let everybody know. Is it a king rat? <laughs> No, I just like oh, that'd huge, be easy to deal with. <laughs> it's a huge swarm now, and uh, more are going to come in three three rounds. So we have not moved through yet. No, you have not. Uh, can I take my whip and just like swing at them and try and knock as many out of the way as possible? Uh, rocks. Oh. it's clear enough that we can go through. Yeah, yeah. I'll just go through. Okay, yeah, you'll go through. So you'll just you'll just move through. All right. Good thing I'm going last. <laughs> <laughs> Johnson, you're I'm up. Gonna take my stun launcher and right into the heart of the swarm. Right into the heart of the swarm. Which is funny enough that size. All right, roll your shooting. I got a four. You got a four, so they're going to. It's make... just a bigger roll. Yep. And their vigor is pretty good. Really. Dang. <laughs> they get it. They get it on a 14. <laughs> they just laugh. Yeah. <laughs> Creepy voice right. laughs. Um, in that case, um, I'm just going to book it 8, and then with my second action... Wait, no, it's a d10, not a... So in total, I'm going to book it 8, 16... Uh, 23. 23 tiles away. <laughs> yeah, you are... You're back at the, uh, the fork. Um, you almost run into the, uh... <laughs> into the, the tunnel wall. I just catch myself just in time. Yeah, you just catch yourself just in time. So, you are just gone from this fight. With three wounds on you? Yes. Wow! <laughs> you did a lot of damage to me. You yeah. nearly killed me twice already. <laughs> This will be a fun campaign. Oi. Well then, um, it is Odium's turn. <laughs> I have to go after the rats. Yeah, I don't like both Good. of those rats. Ooh, I think I'm weird. going to run away. Okay, so Odium is running away, and now it's their turn. Oh, wait, wait, wait. Can I climb up away from the rats? No, I'll, I'll just run away. Okay, okay. Um, it is now the rat's turn. Because rats can probably climb. They are going to try and uh, <laughs> engulf... <laughs> engulf... Uh, you and your men. <laughs> they can't take us all! <laughs> Four. No! <laughs> and double fours. Eight. Ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen points of damage. I believe that means they're going to be... So I do it based on my toughness, right? Yeah, so your least armored part, seven. so... Oh, that's to just five, all right. So you're going to start taking wounds at nine, so... Wait, what did you say it was? Thirteen. Thirteen. Thirteen, so then one, one wound. You yeah. take one wound. Hmm. Yep. One wound. And you want to soak it? Sure. All right. <laughs> Cool. But I roll my vigor, right? Yep. Your vigor and your wild. Damn it! I did that last time too. Yeah. Yeah. Double threes. I'm already this far. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, Very good. Four. Four. Nice. <laughs> yep. Wounded. You don't take the wound. You're not shaken. No. And, it, and now it's your turn. <laughs> All right. And. If I run through here, are they going to get attack of opportunity? Yes, they are. Those fuckers. <laughs> <laughs> all right. Throw your bag of cans at them. <laughs> Throw all my men in there? I will not. Just feed them to the swarm. <laughs> 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 yeah, I'm going to try to get through the rubble. All right. You get through. How much damage do they do to you as you run? Ah! They deal three. Four points of damage. Oh, my gosh. So they did not enough to hurt you. Just a couple finger bites as you nice. leave. Ow! <laughs> Why do I have your mini? I don't know, that's weird. Time. I'm way gone. Yeah. <laughs> Alright, so yeah, after you get through, another tremor kind of roars out throughout uh, that cavern, and the rocks just kind of collapse again. Some on the rats. Uh, they, they 
there aren't any rats on the other side with you, so either the rats oh, got sw I squished or they that. were trapped. And I just scream out, Ah, suckers! <laughs> Sucks to be you! Over there. <laughs> well, I had to use all of my yeah. to live. Yeah. <laughs> Not be non but to, to live. <laughs> to live. I love rats, because they can automatically hit. They don't have to roll fighting. They can automatically hit. They're little and they deal damage to the least armored part. <laughs> this is just swarms in general. You can be swimming, and then piranha, and then you got the same situation. <laughs> so, continuing on in this cave, you've got one more direction. And it's not very far, hang actually. On. Hang on, hang on. I'm just, I'm just gonna do a quick... Uh, I do not realize that there's another cave in. You don't. No, because yeah. I'm hard of hearing. I'm severely injured, and I'm booking it. Okay. That's a zero. Okay. So, uh, it's dark. I see the fork. Let me see if I remember which way we came from. Yeah, I remember which way we came from. I, I would probably be booking it that way, back towards the light. Back towards the light. Yeah. All right, so he's back at where you guys started. So, you don't know where I went. Right. Because I just left. And when I get there, I'll probably like rest and start doing with my wounds. Okay. So just let me know if something happens. Okay. Yeah. Um. Yeah, you guys make it to right. find you. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Surprise! As they start repelling down. <laughs> they have they have rifles of their own. <laughs> All right. So yeah, you guys uh, make it to the end of that tunnel. Um, you have the way backwards, which is to your right. You have the way forwards to your left. Uh, could I just shout, like Johnson? Where did you go? Yeah, you can. We know you full the red. <laughs> <laughs> they know where we are now. Oh no! You know where I live. Okay. Johnson, which way did you go? Yes. Go. Where are you, Johnson? The mighty warrior, Johnson. <laughs> don't hear it. You don't hear it. Yeah, he's hard of hearing. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Well, the other way is dark, right? Mm-hmm. Why don't we try towards the light and kind of regroup and ask ourselves what the hell just happened back there? I think we just lost a man to some rats. I swear I saw him die. <laughs> yeah, because I moved so fast. <laughs> they just, just like moved without a choice. them. <laughs> he uh, became one of the rats. <laughs> uh, well, we'll go toast to his memory in the light, there, buddy. Let's go. All right, you guys uh, head back the way you came, and you see him tending to his wounds. Can I heal him? Yeah, you can heal him. Okay. Don't worry, Johnson. We got the nurse on the job. Shut up. <laughs> Nurses don't use magic. She's a sassy nurse. You gotta put a complaint in my head. Right, six. <laughs> Eight. Eight. So that would heal two of your wounds. Hmm. Okay, I'm back to full health. You're welcome. Twice I've almost been dead. All right. Yes. In the matter of <laughs> ten minutes. Good job, nurse. I commend you on your abilities, and you are a don't, good don't part of this team. Don't touch me! <laughs> You're a I jerk! Just, I can't lift her morale. You're a you jerk! You're so good at inspiring people. <laughs> <laughs> You're awful at inspiring people! My God, man! Where have you been? You're an asshole! You can't say that. Use that. <laughs> oh, I tried to throw my voice. Let me see if I can throw my voice. What would that be? That... Um, I don't know. Deception? Oh, the uh, throw your voice. <laughs> <out of voice. laughs> um, I don't know. Um, uh, uh, that that one is tricky. Maybe like, just roll me a d4 minus two. Well, and, and your wild die, of course. Three, three. Yeah, they know it's you. <laughs> um, he he doesn't power? have any notice. <laughs> how many power points do I start out with? Um, ten, unless you took a bonus. Yeah. Can ten I do else? another thing? Hmm? Can I do another thing? What is that? Can I make him hallucinate the the can is slapping him? <laughs> yeah, if you wanna if you wanna cast your spell, <laughs> your fear spell. All right, so I just put my fingers like this and I. Stare at him intently, deep in the eyes, and then my eyes look over to his can, 
No! No, I'm not gonna show my face! She has to roll. <laughs> See if it actually happens. <laughs> Oh, it's probably happening. Ten. What's my? This uh, isn't a large burst template, by the way. <laughs> oh, so everyone's gonna see this? Yeah, everyone's gonna see this. <laughs> All right. So uh, everybody must make she a spirit on it. roll. She raised on it. Yep. So. It's a spirit roll at minus two. Do I have to as well? Yeah. <laughs> Wait. Okay. What's your score? Ten. Ten. You just you have to you do a spirit roll at minus nine. Two. I got a seven. <laughs> so you got a five. I got oh, a, a zero. <laughs> zero. Okay. You're so really I... scared of can. <laughs> <laughs> no, 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 I swear to my doctor, I anger you. <laughs> nice. So uh, well, I was trying to be a good commander. <laughs> well, here's here's the thing. Like, yeah, you guys see it, but you're unaffected by it because you're like, yes, Willis, I know. <laughs> Why are you doing this? <laughs> like, but but you on the other hand, you actually see this happen. You're like. What the heck? <laughs> uh, roll me a d20. Oh, boy. <laughs> Thirteen. Thirteen. <laughs> <laughs> you got a minor phobia. <laughs> <laughs> What's the <laughs> He gets, <laughs> he gets a minus two whenever he sees one of your cans. Yeah. <laughs> but, out all the time. but in specifically your cans. <laughs> Is it just Willis? <laughs> He's just Willis. <laughs> yeah, it's, it's, Willis. it's just Willis. He's a good man. He's guided me through good times and bad. <laughs> Look at him. Look at him. Oh, man. <laughs> Look at him. He's got a smile. Oh, that That's a smile. <laughs> That's unfortunate, but <laughs> hi, hi, hilarious. <laughs> uh, yes. And you did expend your power points, right? I have one left. Okay, yep. wow. Yep. I can't do anything with the one, but... So, side note, did anybody bring food? I was thinking about it, but I didn't think we'd have gone that long. I <laughs> think we might have to eat Willis. <laughs> eat Willis! Oh, I mean, never. there are rats back nice. there. I'm down for that. You're down for eating Willis? Look at him! Look at him! Look at him! He's a good guy! <laughs> <laughs> He's like, yes, eat me! I dare you! <laughs> <laughs> he's like a jack-o'-lantern, but as a can. <laughs> a can of lantern. And he's got, like, flaming eyes and stuff, and he's just like, I look delicious! <laughs> uh, side note. You were abused by a can when you were little. <laughs> yes, I kicked the can one too many times, and the can kicks back. <laughs> <laughs> yes. Do none of you have food? I don't have food. <laughs> that was just a random side note, because it's not like you really need to eat at this point, but if you don't have any food, you probably will need to get back. I have money. I was intending on buying stuff later. We can cook some of the rats. Or just eat cook them raw. rats! Good lord, woman! <laughs> <laughs> Do any of you guys have the ability to make fire? <laughs> no. Uh, I can make a brief burst of it. Does anybody have the f have the survival skill? Mm, no. Well, you guys are screwed. <laughs> Wait, I have a guy for that. This is Abraham. <laughs> <laughs> he is my survival expert. <laughs> what does he say about our current situation? We're a little <laughs> 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 yeah, There's no filter on that guy. <laughs> I'll give it to you straight. <laughs> Hmm. Well, at least you're And this is Wes! <laughs> 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 mm. You keep Willis in the bag. Uh, I guess. Just put, put a sack over him. Hey, <laughs> okay, Willis, he doesn't understand. No! <laughs> <laughs> I can't breathe! Yeah. <laughs> well, there was that third tunnel. That is true. We could go down the third tunnel. Now that we've regrouped and I have healed you yet again. Yes, and I thank you for that wonderful nurse. <laughs> Silence. No one likes it when you talk. But I was complimenting you. No one <laughs> likes it. 
I'm putting in a complaint to the higher ups about this nurse. <laughs> <laughs> What's your rank again? <laughs> Commander. I don't know. I never gave myself like, a definite rank. <laughs> Pick one. What a major general. <laughs> yeah. Of a platoon, right? yeah. So I don't have a You'd huge amount be of a mass platoon. Sure. Captain <laughs> Captain MacArthur. Yeah. <laughs> Better than Corporal. Anyways, so yeah, you guys, uh, <laughs> you guys decide to uh, go down that third tunnel. You make it back down the darkness. Nobody even bought a flashlight. What the heck? <laughs> <laughs> We're doing all this in the dark. You guys, you guys I didn't look a ton through all the items, so I just kept. I still have 110 gold. <laughs> yeah. yeah, I have 230. So. But <laughs> jeez. <laughs> I got the fancy. I bought a, I bought a vest in the and a weapon. <laughs> Can I pick her pocket? <laughs> no! <laughs> oh my gosh. Yeah, there's really no pocket pick in here. Don't let him pick your pocket. <laughs> Don't let him pick your pocket. <laughs> what did you say about stealing things in our previous session, Odium? I, it's I'm convinced bad. stealthily. You might it's not notice. Bad. <laughs> you know, I never did trust that green teddy bear. <laughs> 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 so you guys go down this uh, it's, it's not actually a teddy bear. It's not actually a teddy bear. Oh, what the f*** is he? <laughs> he? He's a goblin. I'm a teddy rug spin. Goblin. <laughs> yes, he's, he's a civilized, money-making goblin. Money-making. He yes. steals things. He makes money. Yeah. Unlawfully! <laughs> well, in Brunori, goblins are either... They're either businessmen or they're criminals. <laughs> or they're criminal businessmen. Yeah. Goblin mob! Cop is an actual thing. Or they're regular people who don't fit any stereotype at all. But they do have stereotypes. <laughs> but anyways, um, you guys go, da go down the end of the, the tunnel. You make it to the end of the tunnel, and there is a big room. Uh, the three of you are in pitch darkness, relatively, but you see a you you definitely pick up some heat signatures. But it's like almost a wall of heat signatures in front of you. Oh God! You see in this cavern what looks to be a giant, like fleshy thing, just kind of blocking your way. All I, all I, I see nothing. Yeah, I don't see yep. anything. And you gotta tell I us about it. I hear nothing. I think there might be like... some rats up ahead. Oh, <laughs> you God. see that? Not again! Not again! <laughs> um, yeah. Um, you don't have knowledge of biology. You probably wouldn't even... Would you know... It's kind of moving just a little bit, but it's mostly docile. Make a notice roll. Four. Okay. Bad um, minus one. Uh, we'll we'll say you get it. I'll, I'll be lenient this time. Uh, <laughs> it's only the first session. You see up ahead a tunnel that's kind of being blocked by this fleshy mass. Um. It, it you you also see you also see um, another tunnel that it that it looks to be going down, but it looks like there's enough room for you to fit, and probably enough room if somebody were to just uh, go straight up against the wall and kind of shimmy sideways. It looks to be sort of tubular or tube shaped or whatever. It kind of like it kind of like goes down this one tunnel. And then into like another tunnel that you really can't go through, <clears throat> but then you have this tunnel that it's blocking. It's tubular, man. Tubular. <laughs> We're lacking uh, one. <laughs> I think, think we can. I think we could make it if we squish up against the wall. Make it through what? I don't know, but I see something. It's alive. <sighs> Okay, why are they always alive? <laughs> what What are you talking about? I can't see anything, and I can barely hear you in this mess. That's all, that's all I know. I don't know what it is. <laughs> can I just go up and, like, poke it? Are you asking me, or are you actually doing it? <laughs> I'm just going to go up and poke it with the end of my uh, 
You're gonna like hold out your whip, and when, yeah. you, when you yeah. feel it, like but with like the hard, you know, like grip end of it, just kind of you poke it. It kind of moves a little, and it kind of causes the ground to shake a little bit. Um, the 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 sort of tail, if you will, that was leading into the the cavern that you could get through if you you know put your backs against the wall. It kind of moves a little bit, but only a little bit. And then it kind of becomes docile again. Um, right. Right, it through the tunnel! Everybody make another oh, notice roll. You're going to need an 8 on this one. It's a listen check, by the way. Oh, God. No. It did not make it. Zero. I didn't hear it at all. <laughs> gotcha. Five. Okay. Yeah. Um... The, yeah, it, it, it kind of moved a bit, caused uh, the tunnel that you're, or the cavern that you guys are in to uh, shake a little. Um, but you did, but you did notice from like touching it that it is fleshy, whatever it is. Um, what? What is it? I felt the ground go a little bit. All I can feel is flesh, and I kind of start like <laughs> touching. I'm like, what? Yes, my God! It's the blob. Ah. <laughs> what it's does it feel weird. like? It's just squishy. Like it feels like a body, but there's so much skin. <laughs> Based on that, can I make a biology check? Actually, the and the... I'm going to correct you a little. It is fleshy, but it feels very scaly. There's so many scales. Yeah, make a knowledge biology check. Three. Three. Not quite. Yeah, you're just like, okay, that narrows it down. It's made of flesh and it has scales. Yeah, that's literally hundreds of things. <laughs> hey, I'm doing what I can, okay, <laughs> man? I can't see sh I can't do anything. All I know is it's got scales. Tell them how it tastes. I can see yeah. a way around <laughs> it. We just gotta push up against the wall. Yeah. Well, are you saying it's going into a tunnel? Yes. And you want us to go into the same tunnel, and we'd have to squish up against the wall to get through. I say we send you in there quick to see what it's about. Oh, yeah? Is that how we're gonna play it? You... You can see the dark man. All of us are flying blind. Unless you want to I'm, send Will's no Willis in there. I will. I will. Scout. I will go ahead and explore. Mm. Now, if you I'm want to scout, to by. I got that. <laughs> so I go into. The, <laughs> I go into the tunnel to see if we can get past. Yeah, you go into the tunnel. Mm. You. You make it almost perfectly because of your size. Mm -hmm. Skips on through. Guys, <laughs> yeah. I made it! <laughs> yep, and uh, you notice that there is actually a li another light at the end of this tunnel. It's green, but it's a light. Hey guys, I made it through. There's a green light over here. <laughs> Not sure what's up with that. Are you saying this from like... I'm I'm yelling it through. <laughs> well, green means go at this point, right? I guess. You you okay. wanna you could you wanna squeeze through, or should I come back to you? I'll go through. So do I to roll, or do I just make it? No, you're you're good. You you just go up against the wall, and you just kind of shimmy on shimmy on past it. Right. You uh, it's a little bit of a tight squeeze, especially after it was agitated a little, but. You're able to get past this uh, giant whatever it is. Guys, I'm clear. She said she's clear. <laughs> Wait, so she shocked something? That's what nurses yell, right? Oh, it is. <laughs> Good point, Johnson. She must be using her magical nursing abilities on the other side of this giant fleshy scaly thingy. <laughs> <laughs> That woman, she sure can heal things, but she is a spitfire. I did see one. <laughs> I don't hear this. Because I'm focused on the head. Yeah. <laughs> All right. um, would I be able to make it? Because I'm brawny. I'm a big dude. Ah, uh, yeah. Um, 
Hmm. Give me an agility roll. Oh, boy. Your agility's not that great either? It's a six. That's a four. It's a four. Yeah, you make it through. It's barely. Right. I'll go in afterwards as well. So you guys enter here. So I'll just place my knees accordingly. And then uh, MacArthur falls down. He <laughs> <laughs> da, 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 da. trips over Willis. <laughs> <laughs> you developed a phobia to Willis. <laughs> <laughs> She made that the source of the hallucination. <laughs> uh, at least it's only mine, or not like. Uh, <laughs> Run screaming at the sight of him. So, in front of you is a somewhat disgusting sight. Uh -oh. Do I have to go out again? You see practically the same creature that was in uh, the big tunnel, except it's a smaller version. We never saw it. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, well, but he did. And he didn't really do a good job of explaining what it was. Uh, probably a few more boulders. There's like a huge pile of rubble on top of this thing. But you do, you do kind of see it. It's... Uh, it's essentially a giant worm, but it is, it, it, it's gray, and it has scales, um, and it is also very much crushed underneath a lot of rubble, and it looks like it's uh, green acidic blood kind of just like <laughs> everywhere, um, and it's also glowing. Make a knowledge biology check. The worm is glowing, or the Do blood you acknowledge is Arcana? Um, no. You don't. I, got a five. I have a magic arcane background. Five. Yep. Yeah, you know that there's something unnatural about about this uh, green ooze. You can you assume that it's its blood, and it does look like there's something unnatural about it. It's glowing. One and two. It kind of looks. You you can't tell, but you think it might be moving. The blood. Yeah, it's weird, but yeah, it, it almost looks alive in a sense. So we can like see like the blood is blood is illuminating, kind of. Oh, okay. Yeah. I'm <coughs> going to on that. I'm gonna just pick up a rock. Actually, I tell you, I've seen your skill with those cans. I like. Here, take this rock. Oh, wait. You also figure out that this actually isn't blood. <laughs> oh, okay. <laughs> no, no, what happened was um, a, a, you, you assume that that's acid. And there is a gland that produced that acid, and you assume that when it was crushed, that that gland burst. Okay. Bursted. So that's what you're looking at. Sorry, I should know my own world. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. All right. Um, this stuff has many uses. It's very rare that you can get get it because giant worms are not easy to deal with. Right. But it's acid. It eats through a lot of things. Not glass. That's true. I'm gonna give you a notice roll. Five. You. Notice a corpse sort of slumped over there where the X is. Ooh. I'm going to go up to the edge of this and I'm going to start collecting a couple of vials of this stuff. Yup. You uh, start collecting vials and in one round, Something is going to happen. Can I climb over along the wall over to this corpse? Yeah, make me a climbing check. Unless if you have wall walker. Six. Ten. Ten. All right. 
So on your turn, we'll just say you get over there. How many can I collect in like this time period? Um, I'm gonna say like one per round. Okay. So before before uh, combat started, you got one, and then okay. for this round, you get another one. All right. So what is Jane doing in this round? Um. I will remind you guys, there is, you don't really find, there's not really much, you gotta, you gotta get through, is what I'm trying to say. Mm -hmm. You gotta right. find a way through. I'm just gonna... The alchemist in the end. Uh, uh, man, what's my pace? You can make stuff out of this. Mm -hmm. I'm going to move one, can you two, jump three, over it? four, five, six over here, just so I can kind of see, like, what would be going on if anything is coming through. Okay. Okay. And are you just holding Even there? Even though it's in the yeah. dark. What are, you, yeah. what are you guys doing? It's it's a dead worm. Just don't touch the acid and you'll be fine. Oh, yeah. So, okay. Is there something funny over there? Is there a nice sitting spot? Hmm. No, it's that I can see what's happening if anything comes through She's these puddles. She's scared about um, the, the world. That makes sense. <laughs> Girls are smarter than they look, Johnson. She thinks there might be some rats um, coming to... You're exactly. probably the most useful one in this group. Yeah, you're welcome. Okay. Better stay on my good side. So, so <laughs> after her would be Odium, and we said she went over there. Let's see, do you need to make any more rolls? Uh, no, actually, actually, yes. Um, you give me a notice roll, I guess. I eh, just don't. Do you want to search the body or do you not? <laughs> I do want to search the okay, body. Okay, we'll just say you do it. Um, you find you find a scroll on the skeleton. Oh. And uh, you, yeah, it's, it definitely looks scroll. like a magic user. And you find a wand as well. Ooh. It's Harry Potter. <laughs> you don't really know what the scroll is for. And you don't know what the wand is for, but you know that it's... A scroll and a wand. If I have arcane background magic, could I maybe identify it? Or do you have knowledge arcana? No. That's what you use to identify that. Or yeah. detect conceal magic. Because mm -hmm. detect conceal arcana is a spell that you can use, and then um, knowledge arcana is. Well, one basically tells you whether or not there's actually magic there, yeah, and then the skill tells. tells you what it is, yeah. Hey guys, I didn't find anything on this body. <laughs> <laughs> Alright. Wait, what is a, uh, is that, is there like a bluff check, or a... Um, there is persuasion. So, mm, would, is, you would have to persuade us that he didn't find anything, right? Or could I detect his lie? Uh, Yeah. You would make mm -hmm. a persuasion check, and you would make a spirit check. Okay. What was, what was your question? There's no, like, deception. It's all just under the persuasion skill. Yeah, it's just all persuasion. Okay. But since I don't have persuasion, I would roll Except that minus at a minus two. two so Plus whatever your charisma mod is, so... Zero. So that means <laughs> so that two. <laughs> you know something's up. <laughs> <laughs> With a solid, don't you have a plus one charisma? Too? No, I got rid of it. And I put no. the uh, weapon. All right, okay. so you definitely know something is up. Uh, listen, I know you found something over there. Yeah, ugly little green back teddy bear. <laughs> <laughs> found another can of soup. <laughs> yeah. What'd you find? A can of soup. Oh, a can of soup. <laughs> a can of soup. <laughs> It looks suspiciously like a man. <laughs> we could eat that can of soup. <laughs> All right, so now we have John. Like you have no food. We've got like fifty <laughs> cans. <laughs> <laughs> I don't have any food. <laughs> so now we have Johnson, who I assume you're just I'm collecting more of this collecting stuff. more sludge. Do you have any flasks on you? I yeah, I do. Empty flasks. I have, cool. I have syringes. I have flasks. I have all that stuff. Nice. And then uh, what is MacArthur <laughs> doing? Uh, Captain Ulysses MacArthur. <laughs> I will. Is it okay if I just call it worm acid? I'll just move right here. Uh, yeah. And uh, be a boss. <laughs> That's it. All right. Fifty men. Yep. 
So you see um, some of some of the uh, acid just kind of coagulate and uh, like sort of pool up around here, and you see a form emerge. And yes, I know that's a that's a cutesy looking sludge there, but I mean, it's uh, it's all I have. It's all I have on as far as slimes and sludges go. He's trying to charm his way to he's us. He's trying to. He's trying to burn his way into Does your the heart. Slime have an eye. No, oh. it's just it's just goo. It's just a acidic slime. So I can't aim at its eye. No, but you can aim at it. All right, so hand me hand back your cards. Yes, I don't like that card anyway. Let's start another round, and. The timer is reset for four rounds. How many power points have I gained back at this point, Denny? No. Okay. You screwed us. I mean, I like that he got a phobia. I think that's awesome. <laughs> 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 you yes. have been through hell through this through this <laughs> session right now. Your character's almost died like two or three times. <laughs> Gained a phobia. <laughs> this is not a fun afternoon excursion <laughs> like I was promised. <laughs> I was promised drugs and this is what I get. Oh, the right. acid is very valuable to the right people. So I'm okay. So he's just going to move here for now. And that's going to be the end of his turn. Or its turn. Okay. Yeah, I see it. <laughs> Just give you like, because that's working with acid, you don't want to hurt <laughs> yourself. I need to get an eight in order to see it. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. If you're like doing, if you're just like trying to focus on what's in your hands, it's. Yeah. Um, I know that because. Painting, yeah. No. One of my one of my supervisors was like looking at her phone. And I was just walking up to her. I thought I thought she knew that I was there because like her side was towards me. But then I just like walked up to her. She turned around and was like, ah! <laughs> She got a minor phobia of Mac. There's a reason. Yeah. <laughs> there's a reason why there's a running joke at work that I'm the ghost of the theater. Yep. <laughs> All right. So. Uh, so when we can call you fan of the opera. <laughs> One day, maybe, <laughs> when I actually get that role. All right, so, MacArthur, you are uh, up first. Yep. Uh, wait, so I see this gooey little ball of gooness? Yep. I say, ah! It's a big ball of goo! <laughs> <laughs> would I know that this is, like, an enemy? Like, uh, would, you, would you know that it's alive? Would you know that? Yeah. What? Um, yeah, you, it kind of startles you, because it's like... This was just acid a while ago, and now it's alive? Alright, reactionary time. Get up, Jefferson! <laughs> <Will's>. mm -hmm. <laughs> and I'm throwing a can at it. <laughs> Alright, uh, roll your throwing. <laughs> ah. <laughs> Two. I'll give this to you. You try to throw it at him, but it lands, like, over here or something. <laughs> like, not in the acid. Dang it, Jefferson! Alright, well, Johnson, I'm you are up. See that? Do I know what it is? If you want, you can roll knowledge biology as a free action. Five. Five. Um, you know that that shouldn't exist. <laughs> that it shouldn't exist. Okay. Yeah, you've that's, never. That's what I know. You've never heard of random acid just like all of a sudden becoming a life form. I will. But it definitely. Uh, that is adorable. But it definitely reinforces your hypothesis that this goo looks alive. Because it probably is. Hmm. Interesting. Uh, then I'm going to throw a stun at it. Like off the back wall. Alright. Um, I think I have the. Yeah. Yeah. Four. Four. You got it. So it's just a bigger roll, or it becomes stunned. Yeah, just a straight up bigger roll. Um, and it gets it. Oh. Uh, <laughs> all right. I'm going to also back away. All right. 
Got it. That thing shouldn't be alive. It's not natural, whatever it is. There's never been acid oozes. I don't know what to call it. It's a thing. It's, a thing. it's probably very dangerous. Don't let it touch you. <laughs> Alright, so what is Jane Poole doing? Uh, can I, like, pick up a rock and throw it at it? Yeah, sure. Okay. That's gonna be long range. Yeah, here, first I'll move. There you go. There so you I hit it from range. there. That's yep. close range. Two. No! Andy, crit fail. <laughs> no, step back, Jane. We'll handle does, this! Does, does she <laughs> knock uh, Jefferson into the acid? <laughs> <laughs> Um, <laughs> you know, yeah, I'll say that because <laughs> you gave me the idea. Blame him, not me. Yeah! <laughs> you throw it, and it's Jefferson. He just like kind of rolls into the acid, and it does. And then Jefferson. <laughs> I'm just kind of sitting there looking. Like, hey. <laughs> <laughs> All right, and uh, now it is Odium's turn. Does this thing notice me? Uh, are you trying to be stealthy? Um, I haven't been up to this point. Um, I think it's safe to... S uh, I mean, at this point, I'd probably ask the question, do you notice it? Yeah, because it is on the other side of the worm. Yeah. The worm's, like, massive. <laughs> and you're, you're tiny. Oh. Uh. Well, if I don't notice it, the You know something's there, because I just shouted out, like, this thing shouldn't exist. <laughs> and you kind of just, like, launched a stun grenade at it. Yeah, big flash. <laughs> <laughs> I'm going to stealth over to here. Alright, I'm going to need a climb check, and then I'm going to need a stealth check from you. That's his notice. That is a four. So, ten... Ten? Yeah. Uh, no, you... no, um, six plus, um, eleven. Eleven for the climb check? Mm hmm Yeah, you got it. Um, now roll your stealth, and you're looking to beat a seven. Wait. Five. Because he doesn't even have notice. Hey, he got it. He might have it with a raise, too. So... Nine, Nine uh, uh, 11. Okay, so you got it. Um, and we will say that that is you right now. You are just stealthed out from this thing. Okay, and I can see it now? Yeah, yeah you can see it. I think I'm going to fire an arrow at it. Let's see what that does. Okay, fire your arrow at it. Now, how does the uh, range work on this? I have a 12, 24, 48. Uh, he matter. is within close range. If he was um, past 12 inches away, he would have a minus one penalty. And if he was past 24 inches away, he you would have a minus two penalty. And then if he was past, like, 48 inches away, which is more... Oh, I think even the 24 is more than this entire board. <laughs> You know, then you wouldn't be able to fire it at all. You, I got a three. A three. Did you get bonuses because he's stealth out? Oh yeah, I got a plus two for drop. Plus two. It would actually be a plus six because the drop is uh, originally a plus four. Oh. And your thief would get, or your assassin would give you an additional plus two. Okay. Oh no, wait. That's for damage. I think. Oh. Let me... Yep, it's just damage. So you you do have a plus four to your attack from the drop. Okay. So, so seven. Seven, which would actually be a hit. I'll do I side after that flash of light. I don't know. Yeah, roll your damage. Um, eight plus six or whatever is what you said. Eight, eight. plus six. Yeah, 14. Yep. All right. Uh, yeah. You fire your arrow at it, and it just kind of... And kind of discombobulates, or whatever. 
Nice. Sweet. <laughs> it just kind of blah, 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 there. That, that place, exactly. <laughs> but you are no longer stealth to it. <laughs> All right, that is the end of the round. Pass back your cards. I'll draw new ones. All right, so I get an eight. Odium gets an eight. Ooh, Johnson gets an ace. <laughs> MacArthur a two, and Jane a two. Nice. <laughs> That's unfortunate. <laughs> All right. I just popped an ugly green thimble. <laughs> oh, yeah, I don't deal myself in. I forgot about that. Oh, well, I'll just what put that there. Doing? So, uh, yeah, Johnson, what are you doing? Seeing that it uh, coagulated into a creature, I think I'm going to take a couple extra vials of this stuff, so I'm going to collect a few more of this. Odium, what are you doing? Where do we come from? Do we come from the... You came, from, you came from here. This is the other end. I'm going to go... Look. Down this way. Okay. So you see a faint light up here. ahead. But you do know that this tunnel yeah, so leads into another yeah. cavern. How do we propose we get across the acid? Oh, that's what I was wondering. Yeah. Jump. Is any of us a long jump champion? No. The, uh, Can any of you climb? The, the shortest jump. point looks about seven feet across. Yeah. You can always run and jump. Yeah, that's what I was saying. But I don't want to ruin my shoes. Pull the... Oh, <laughs> oh yeah. <laughs> With what? Although I will say, this is one of those situations where I wrote it and I was just like, I'm just going to give them a situation and see what they yeah. do with it. Uh, how far are you these could rocks climb over the. the yeah, yeah, how far are the rocks from the edge of the acid on both sides? Um, well, you don't really notice the other side, but on this side, you could probably easily. If you could jump and then climb up on top of the rocks, um,. You could you could definitely get on top of there and try to jump on the other side easy easily, uh, but that's the thing. It's trying to climb onto the rocks. Yeah. The rocks may be unstable, but you don't know. You don't know whether or not they are. Well, I'll just move over here to what I looks mean, there's a worm like thing. it's still half alive, right? Oh or yeah, no? is it? It's it's dead. Oh, okay. It's dead, Jim. Expect jump. Right, so I'm it's just gone. gonna move there for my turn. All right. Um, and then what is, what is Johnson doing? Just walk doing? through it. You don't need your you feet. <laughs> what is MacArthur doing? Yeah. I first. Stubs. I'll come with. Da, 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 da. All right, guys. Hand in your cards. We got two more rounds. There's a cavern up ahead. It's a light. I can see it. Lando. Ace of Spades, King, Queen, Whoa. and Three. <laughs> <laughs> we all these big car and three. <laughs> but just a lonely pawn in this game we call life. <laughs> you mean in this game we call Savage World? <laughs> yeah, right. I'm gonna hold mine. Okay, so you would just hold. So you that means you would forfeit your turn, but you can go basically whenever you want. I gotta collect uh, another vial of this stuff. He's collecting another vial of this stuff. <laughs> Alrighty then. I'll so just we know out. that it's not. It doesn't dissolve glass. I don't know how. I, I'm a little weird about running and that, jumping over here. I have never encountered right. an acid. That One is glass. that I'm going to. Uh, Get your feet eaten. Oh you, can make, the, uh, you can make both powerful poisons and powerful medicines out of this stuff. Like I am nerding out. But we also have to get on the other side of this. I got my trick. Care to share with the group, Johnson? It's, it's a single person trick. 
bastards. Let me just activate my little soup thing. And oh, yeah. Now, wait, could you carry a person like the. Mm, you could probably carry me because I'm trying to. But I'm already, already over, over there. there. Right. <laughs> Yeah, you're good. You're Come you're back an this fire. way. Uh, I mean, this is like this is like home to you. Like <laughs> this is your natural element. <laughs> How much does your character weigh? With all their gear? Thirty-two. Well, thirty-two gear, but well, thirty-two your gear, character. and then my weight limit is forty. I don't no, know how much your like, character. Like I don't know, one hundred and twenty pounds. Like. I'd be at minus three doing that. I mean, what I can say you can do if you really want to run in... What I can say is you can... Um, to get across... Is there, a way, you, is there a way to collapse more of the rubble over here to make this like... Right. A, you can try that. Path? You can try that. Would I like shoot at the ceiling? I can't think of any other... I don't really have explosives. Yeah, you can you can do that. All right, I'm gonna shoot the ceiling to try to knock rocks loose. All right, <laughs> let's do it. You Hopefully, we don't all die. The entire cave collapses. <laughs> this is just shooting, right? A four. Four. You get it. Uh, roll your damage. Seven. Twelve. Twelve. Yeah, I'll say you got it. Nice! I'll say you got it. I'll say that one stalactite falls down here, um, it's going to completely dissolve in two rounds. Oh, jeez! <laughs> um, but yeah, it's there. there's a stepping stone, at least. Like, is it enough to get across? If you wager, if you, if you can jump on it, yeah. It, it makes it easier to jump across. Okay, so can I like... Right, he, he's done, right? Yep. Can I jump on it and try to move across? Yeah, so. give me an agility check. One. Six. One. You got it. <laughs> a six and a one. <laughs> you got right. it. You get safely across. See you suckers on the other side. <laughs> oh, man. <laughs> And then you just collapse the cave. <laughs> nah. Um. Yeah. So that that was your end turn. It's the end of the round. Okay. End of the round. So we have one more round until that thing is gone, and one more round until until another one of those oozes spawns. We don't know that second card though. Uh. Right. Yeah. Joe, can you hand me that card? Oh yeah. Cool. All right. Four for you, ten for you, Joker. Oh, oh wait, you held your action. I did. I did yeah, you didn't have to hand back the card. You were just on hold. Oh. Uh, yeah. So you can. So both of you can go whenever you want, but you also get like a plus two to every roll you get. Yes, I need round. to skip across these stones. Okay. Uh, roll your agility. Nice. So, 12. All right. So, yeah, you get across as well. You, kazaa, kazaa, kazaa. you and Jane are both pretty much right there. Next up would be Jane or Odium if you want to go. Do you want to go? Can I? You said there was a light over here. Can I see that? Yeah. Okay. I'm going to go towards the light. Well, you're in here, so you don't have to go towards the light. <laughs> <laughs> I was waiting for that joke. <laughs> I am just waiting to get rid of you. <laughs> okay, so... You see a very large cavern um, with a bunch of stalactites and stalagmites going on there. Um, you also see, to your far right, um, it, it looks like uh, the cave wall has kind of given way to an actual wall. Like, there's a brick wall sort of built into the cave wall, if you will, but that has kind of crumbled and collapsed, so it kind of leads into a room over there. 
You're not exactly sure if it's a basement or what, okay. but that's that's where it leads. And then there is a tunnel leading to your left. Can I run into the basement or whatever it is, the building? Um, not this round. That would end your turn. I guess I'll follow her to the cavern. Okay, so both of you guys are in the cavern now. And, uh, Johnson, what are you doing? I'll follow. They seem to be done. Okay, uh, so you want to give me an agility check? Yeah, after I uh, ingest some, some grease. Some grease? Some monkey oh, some grease. monkey grease. Gotcha. Eleven. Eleven. All right, yeah, you got it. Um, you are now with them. What does monkey grease do? Yeah. It increases your agility die type by one. Uh, yep. Okay. It's, a, it's a drug that effectively increases your agility. Nice. All, all right, right, so all of all you guys have made it across. Right. All of you guys have made it across. Um, yeah. Um, you're pretty much following after them. I have a pace eight. I can catch up. My yeah, you're 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 following behind. Uh, you guys are already in that in that tunnel, sort of, or in that cavern. Uh, MacArthur, you're kind of still there. You see another one of those green goopy things, sort of spawn. Uh, and I am going to actually erase this and. Draw the other cavern, and uh, we'll get we'll get to that action. We'll assume that you're back in this realm. These are cookies. These are cookies. Yes, <laughs> those are big. Cookies. I knew it. Those are stalagmites. I'll we'll put one here as well. There. All right. So you guys are well. You're kind of still back here. Uh, MacArthur, but you guys, Johnson, Odium, and Jane, you guys are around here. You're actually more inside of the cavern. Yeah, you uh, you see there are two sources of light in this room, sort of. Well, actually, a major source of light is coming from inside of the room. Uh, the rest of the cavern is mostly dim. You also sort of, well, you don't really see it, but you kind of feel it. There are tremors going on. And, uh... There's more rats show up. <laughs> they can't even kill me once. <laughs> They're back to figure out. back to finish me off. So you guys um, feel tremors, actually, and it gets, you know, closer and closer and, and more intense and more intense. Thank you. <laughs> is there a way <laughs> Just inside this building? Up. Yes, there is actually a broken section of the wall, kind of, like, right there. Uh, nope. Because nope. we are still in the middle of combat. Oh. It's just not the... I, I just didn't start the new round officially yet. Oh, okay. But anyways... Um, yeah, so the, the ground right here begins to break away. Like, right here. Oh, God, there's not a, again. There's a big old hole right there, and out from it pops this guy right here. Uh -oh. This is... Well, essentially, essentially think of what you saw in the last cavern. It's a, it's a giant worm. We, we've already established that. It's a giant worm, uh, but it is, uh... This one is actually alive and kicking. Oh, I'm gonna ride then. So the stalactite in the other cavern uh, has fully dissolved. Uh, another one of those sludges has kind of emerged, and we now start another round of combat. Cool, oh, wait, I'm actually so going last this time. So, Odium, you actually go first. Can I stealth around over to here? Yeah, you can move over there and then try and make a stealth check against its notice. So, six. Okay, so six for your stealth. 
What is his notice? Okay, his notice is a D8. That's not an 8, that is a 10. <laughs> Alright, he got a 5. Solid 5. I have really and you said my, you got a 7? Uh, my cat six, addiction is six. a little out of control, but eh. <laughs> so you just there. you just barely I'm managed to stealth out. A lot. <laughs> I pretty much drink coffee all day. Can I sh <laughs> um, shoot from there? Yes. Now, what is the targeted aiming? Yes. Do I have to take a turn to do aiming? that? Yeah, that's you don't yep. do anything this turn, and next turn you get plus two on your. Shot. Unless if you have the marksman edge, which I don't think. Which I do. don't. I will I do that. Okay, I so will. I will take plus two on my next turn. So you will aim. Cool. I had it in the past life. <laughs> oh my goodness! You're stealthed out and aiming. All right. All right. Next up is Jane. So my whip has a reach of two, so I'm gonna take one step forward Did and aim for its eyes. Just kind of like uh, slash six. it across and try and. It doesn't have an eye. Really, it doesn't have any eyes. Have any eyes. Like I'm just gonna one. whip it across the snout, see if I can like, I don't know, deter it. All right. Yeah. It, maybe. Yeah. Um. Yeah. Make an attack against it. Yeah. Uh, you just gonna try and get in its mouth. No, just like slice it across its face. Uh, <laughs> piss it off. Faces? You're trying to piss it off. Okay. Four. Four. Uh, yeah, it kind of lurches backwards, and uh, the whip kind of just cracks right in front of its face. Or if it has, I guess in front of its mouth. Right. <laughs> but uh, yeah, you, you miss. Completely yeah. miss. Next up is MacArthur. You are still in the other cavern with one of those... Uh, one of those um, sludges. I'm hooking it down this way. Ah! It down they, got, they got Jefferson. <laughs> no, he's already dead. I'm a little cross with our nurse for killing Jefferson, but you know, that's just what happens when you're in the, the line of duty. <laughs> Sometimes your nurse kills you. <laughs> Alrighty then. Careful with what right, you so say next, or it might as well be you. <laughs> so, uh, do I. Can I run down that whole hallway? Well, I'm yeah, like, yeah, you can run. You can run. Uh, roll me a d6, and that will be added. Yeah, you add an extra six to your movement. You, six. Nah, you yeah. work <laughs> that's that's that working for running. You can't just suddenly become the flag. <laughs> <laughs> I can do that. Yeah. You do Twice have a, a uh, minus one penalty. I think it was. Mm. Yeah, it was a minus, minus one for running. Minus one running penalty to whatever action you do next. Oh, so I can still... Extra you can, you can still attack. Oh, okay. You would just get a minus... I'll try two. shooting at him. You get a minus two because you're in darkness, or in dim lighting. Okay. Ah, dim, just like you. <laughs> Wait, did you say minus two? Minus two. No, yeah, because you... Yeah. Yeah, that's going to be a mess. All right. Next up is myself. Yep, it's Johnson. It's Johnson. Everybody knows it's Johnson. <laughs> Does the nurse trust me? Do you sure. trust me? Sure. I can show okay. you the world. <laughs> <laughs> Leave it for the auditions. <laughs> I'm going to inject her with some rock hard. Oh, God, no! <laughs> <laughs> All right. If we some no! rock hard. <laughs> yep. <laughs> and then run over here. Are you sure this isn't like this world's it dying? <laughs> <laughs> it gives you plus two armor. Yep, your your armor is at plus two right and now. it's non-addictive. Sweet, sweet. Okay. And it's non-addictive. Good. What's the duration on that, Hanson? I'm too uh, lazy to look it up myself. Is I believe it's three rounds. I'll double check. I have it all here. That's sweet. Yeah, it's three rounds. So when that worm busts a cap on your ass, you'll be fine. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, so yeah, basically you have an extra two toughness to every area. Right. I'll put that there to let everyone know. Okay. So next up is the worm's turn. What kind of interesting things can I do with this worm? <laughs> Well, I'm going to roll a d4 for a timer, and uh, then he is going to 
Well, he kind of rears back, and then he just... <laughs> and just kind of spits acid in sort of this general direction. Uh-oh. <laughs> so, I'm going to need agility rolls from... From uh, MacArthur and from Jane. Oh, you might kill your army. No! <laughs> Four! Four? Yeah. Bye. Okay, you guys you guys managed to barely dodge out of the way, but it was kind of a close call. You, were, <laughs> you guys were just like, what? What the heck is going on here? Ninja somersault. So that's going to be around for four turns. There's uh, some acid on the ground left over from the attack. And, Does my uh, agility mean I did this one? Yeah, did, did we, like, move out of the way? or? Yeah, we'll say you moved out of the way. Okay. We'll say you moved out Otherwise, of the way. I would have no flesh. And essentially, when you move around in it, then you have to make an agility roll, or your armor becomes be damaged. Uh, or you take 2d4 damage if you're not wearing any armor. Only 2d4. You know, I think Jefferson would have put up a lot better fight. <laughs> <laughs> and uh, that's going to be the end of its turn. Captain MacArthur is first. Can I shoot and then move? I can do it out of order, right? Uh, uh, we'll say you can. Normally in Savage Worlds you can't, but it makes, it makes sense if you can. Yeah. Alright. Well, I'm going to... I'm gonna shoot to that guy right there. Get my good old. Pop yeah, I'm gonna say that some of this, some of this uh, cave just like also eroded, erodes away. So I don't think I, I got it. You got a four. Yeah. You got a four. Apply plus two to that roll because it is large. Oh, so a six. Minus two because well. Four? <laughs> yeah. Minus <laughs> one. Minus one, Cause actually. This time. Yeah, because it... Okay, gotcha. Because it is dim. We were fighting in dim lighting. That's a minus one. Plus two because it's large size. So you got a five. Which is a hit. <laughs> in so many words or less. <laughs> Just tell me, Matt. <laughs> it's like when we're playing Magic the Gathering with Matt. It's like, did I lose already? Just tell me. <laughs> oh, well, and then if I... And I... <laughs> yeah. Two hours later. Two hours later. <laughs> Ooh. Oh, 15. ace on ace on the oh, day. I forgot about that. Yep. <gasps> so a twenty. A twenty. Rifles also have AP two. AP two. What's that mean? So you ignore two armor. Oh, cool. When calculating damage. I didn't know what that meant. <laughs> so yeah, its toughness is an eleven after the AP. So that's about two wounds on it. Nice. Yeah, you did just enough to injure it twice. And then I'll move behind the stalactite. type. <laughs> <laughs> that might provide you a little comfort. <laughs> and hope that, that it it just just dissolves the stalactite and doesn't dissolve my face. If you're really <laughs> lucky he's in that square, otherwise you would have tripped over him. <laughs> <laughs> yep. Alright, so Johnson, it is your go now. Uh, I'm going to have a shoot with my shotgun. Scatter gun, not a shotgun. You're behind this hey, wall? Uh, it's not, like, half-destroyed here or anything? Well, I mean, like, this is where it's half-destroyed. Oh, so I'd have to be here? Yeah. Okay. He shoots the wall several times. Yeah. <laughs> he shoots the rocket down, over, and then and he needs to shoot. He's like when I'm practicing sneak in Skyrim, and just, like, going like this into a wall. <laughs> <laughs> What's he doing? Four, I'm practicing four, my five, sneaking! Five, five, five. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so minus one for dim lighting, plus two because it's large. So and you got plus it. Two because of the scatter gun. Yep, that's Sorry, a hit. Seven. Five. Eight damage. Eight points of damage. It just kind of bounces off of its scaly armor. And it's pretty low. Yep. Alright, All right. so it's turn. Wait, so how much damage do you need to do to wound it? Eleven, did he say? Or no? It's 13. It's really 13, but if you have yeah. AP2, which your rifle has, then it would be 11. Jeez, oh, that is a lot of... This is a good thing I got all those extras last time. I mean, I can... That's from this range, I'll usually get a raise, because I get plus 4. 
Yeah. Two for my scatter gun, two from it being large. So I get plus three overall, so Hmm. I actually can't miss unless I get double ones. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, so it's going to spray acid over here again. Do 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 do. It determined you to be the larger threat. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, pretty much because you just, you know. Yeah. Oh, yeah, and it goes before you go. Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> All right, I'm going to need agility rolls from you guys. What about I have a stalactite? Yeah, the, the stalactite. Shouldn't it, like, half my damage or something? <laughs> yeah, well, yeah we can do really half damage, but somewhere. you still have to make an agility right. roll. <laughs> So if you get hit, you're taking half of whatever you want. Agility. Five. You know, roll damage just for funsies. The four. A, a four. four. And a five. And a five. You guys make it. Oh. So, I feel like that that acid has to be pretty nasty if it hits you. Yeah. And yeah. now I am stuck in between two acids. <laughs> <laughs> All right, and the acid is sticking around for three rounds. So both of these are sticking around for three rounds. And I wonder who's <laughs> going to spit next. <laughs> oh my gosh. That's the situation. <laughs> okay. That's going to be one heck of an agility roll to try and make. <laughs> All right, and it is Jane's turn. All right, exactly. it's my turn. Isn't it? Yeah, oh, oh, yeah, it is your turn. Yeah, no, it, my bad. And he's got Shoot mega him bonuses arrow. on this hit. Yep. He's got plus four from the drop. Plus two from aiming. And plus two from it being large. Yep. So he's got plus eight because he doesn't get a penalty from dim lighting. Oh my goodness, this is going to be a big hit. <laughs> Ten plus eight. <laughs> yeah, that's a raise. That, 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 that's a raise. You're firing, you're firing a bow, right? Um, yep. Yeah. Okay. Oh, so there's a chance you could actually stay So, stopped. yes, exactly. Um, can I borrow one of these? Yep. Go for it. Come on, high numbers. That's a 10. Uh, that's a 10 plus 6. All from it. Oh, yeah. Because the drop, the and he's assassin. Oh, yeah. He's, so an he's got 16 off that. He's got 16 off of that. Um, and since... Oh, I forgot to resolve the shaken status. I am so sorry, guys. Let me just roll that first. I'm actually going to Benny that. Yeah. I'll just put that here for now. Actually, oh yeah. That Benny was this on this. a three? So here's the thing, guys. Yeah, that was on a three. Okay, so here's the thing, guys. In Savage Worlds, you can just spend a Benny to get out of Shaken. Yeah. You don't need to make a roll. You can just uh. be like, I'm, I'm just out of Shaken. Mm. Yeah. So, I'm going to... That one's in use. Or is it? Yeah, it's in mm -hmm. use. Okay, so, one, two, three, four. I'll give this to you. Yay! Oh. <laughs> she don't need no more bennies! <laughs> 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 He's like, no, they're done! I okay. use every single one to not die right at the start. <laughs> Alright. So, yeah, you did shake him. From a goblin. I will say that. <laughs> You <laughs> shook him, but yeah. this didn't damage him. That was why I had to you think about yes. that. Yes, yes, okay. <laughs> Rolls a 32 damage. So, my turn then? Yes, now it is your turn. All right, I'm gonna go. Am I still still? One, two, three, four. Don't you have to roll off? Five. Yes. Six. I'm gonna go right on top of his uh, shaken thing. You gotta beat a seven. Who remains stealthed? Oh, he got it. Okay, you got it. You're still stealthed. Uh, what were you doing? I moved. You moved. Nice. Uh, are you going to attack him? Uh, yes, I'm going to swing at him again. Cool. Eight. Eight. All right. Um, you hit. Roll your damage. All right. All right. Fifteen? Fifteen. Nice. No, wait. Thirteen. Thirteen. Oh, I can't math. Alright. Well, <laughs> since he's already shaken, um, it does give him another wound. Yay! So he is currently at three wounds, guys. Congratulations, he's almost dead. <laughs> Alright. 
Hand in your cards. Man. Time for another round. I really need to go before this damn creature. <laughs> I mean, you wounded him last. Maybe he'll spit at you. That's <laughs> what I was thinking. All right. He gets a seven. Odium gets a four. Johnson a four. MacArthur a six. <laughs> and Jane with the king. <laughs> Woo! You kill him. You kill him now. <laughs> you like to try. Um, I also need you to make a notice roll. Oh, boy. D6. And it isn't a minus one, but... Okay. Four. You got it. Yeah, you seem to... S you see something from behind these stalactites here. <clears throat> oh, about, about there. Um, it doesn't... It, it does look like it's moving, but it doesn't seem alive or anything like that. Not moving, but alive? Right. Or, not, you're moving, but not alive. <sighs> yep. Moving, but not alive. Uh -oh. Be water. Yeah, that's true. Oh no! Wait, never mind. It's not moving. It's just there. It it's metallic in nature. Um, it looks like a metal rod of sorts. You kill the one. You kill man. I'm gonna put my <laughs> whip on my belt and go over here to check it out. Okay. Yes. Can I yeah. Check it up. It looks. It looks like some kind of piece of machinery. Can I take it with me? Let yeah, sure. Pick it up and take it. Okay. Yeah. All right. So that that means it's its turn. <laughs> oh boy. <laughs> well, first off, it's shaken. Um, second off, it's a new round, so yeah. timers go down. And third off, now we got all these targets. Who was the? You were the one who attacked it last. Mm -hmm. So it is going to do that do that thing against you. It's going to turn your I way. Mean, I guess it's a good thing you picked up the metal piece because it would have dissolved in it. <laughs> and he is going to just spit all over that area. He's going to spit all over. You want an agility? I'm assuming. Yes. Use one of those bennies you got. You got tons of them. Yeah, I could have that. Use the red yes, one. Yes, you can. Then it doesn't get another. Yeah, if you use the red one, it doesn't go back to him because that's like your personal one. Yep, uh, that is true. All right, spending the personal benny. <laughs> oh, oh. <laughs> nope, she takes the higher roll. Oh yeah. Use another benny. <laughs> <laughs> and like a gambling woman at a casino. <laughs> Aha! There, there you go. go. Ah! <laughs> Seventeen. All right, where would you like to move your character? Uh, anywhere, anywhere on the map. Seventeen. <laughs> yeah, right. Can I move like right here? Well, you can move like right here or right, right here. There. Yep. Okay. All right, and this thing is going to be around for three rounds. I'm going to be running out of D D fours. I'm going to have to go <laughs> buy like a ton of them if I'm going to use this this custom <laughs> rule. <laughs> Where, like, status effects stay on the ground. Oh, my gosh. Okay. So that's the end of its turn. I like how there's just these ooze, ooze lines everywhere. <laughs> yeah, there's just, like, there's just, like, tell where he's heaved all over. <laughs> 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 okay, so... Once it stops moving, then it goes and roll. Yeah. MacArthur's turn. All right. I'm going to shoot stand him. Come on, Schuston! So you got plus one to this six. overall. Six. So a seven. Eight. Eight. Seven and eight. Oh, an eight? Yeah, that's a raise. Nice. Yeah, plus two so from it being large. And, from yep. Uh -oh. Two. Uh -oh. Five. Five. Uh -oh. <laughs> Yeah. Wait, can, can I have any damage rolls? No, nope. you need nope. a special no. edge for that. There's an edge <laughs> called No Mercy that you would use to do that. <laughs> Which is something I would probably didn't, be picking Didn't Trevor have that last time? Yes. Yeah. Didn't you I have that too? I had it. Oh, yeah. I added it. We all had it. We all had it. Merciless party. <laughs> so, Odium, what are you doing? I am going to shoot, but since I'm not aiming, I don't get the extra plus two. But okay. you have the drop. 
And it's large, so you still yeah. have plus six. I had like a 14 on my shoot. Yeah. Okay. Uh, 14 on your shooting. Yeah, that is a raise. It's a 7, 5, 12, plus, um... 6 for your bonuses? 6. Plus 6. Uh, what is that all together? 18. 18. Give him a wound. <laughs> Actually, I'm going to give him a soak roll. <laughs> oh, he, he could keep this thing alive all day if he needed to at this point. Right. I could. Oh, those bennies. Well, it's at minus three because it had three wounds already. So eight to seven. Eight. <laughs> that's it. Twelve. <laughs> yeah, I think he's got it. <laughs> so it's still alive. All right. So one, two, three, four. Four. Makes sense. <laughs> one, two, three, four. I mean, why do I have to re? Wow. Okay. Wow, you get the other one. That was another four. <laughs> you said it with nothing! <laughs> <laughs> Please! <laughs> Alright. This uh, timer goes away. This goes down to two. You're uh, no longer rock hard. Oh, I need to roll my spell. Yes, you do. These two right here are... It's what the drug gonna is ...gonna be called, around for okay. one more round. <laughs> so six... I have two got a six. So roll again? Yep. Ooh. It's coming down to the wire here. Eleven. Eight. Eight. You are still stealthed. Ooh. Hand back your cards. We will start. Uh -uh. What? Uh -uh. Oh yeah. You. Me, yeah. You. <laughs> I'm gonna have a shooty shoot at it. Okay. It's a very technical term for yes. what he does. A shooty shoot. Six. <coughs> ten. Thirteen. It's a raise. Good. Good. Well, you do get. You did ace on one six. Yeah. <laughs> ten. Sixteen. Twenty-one. You throw those bennies at us. At me. <laughs> Give them to me. <laughs> you get right. 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21. So two? Yeah. That's two wound territory. That's two wounds. Let's see if I can keep it alive. So you need an 11. <laughs> and please, no no more bennies <laughs> to bed. Oops. <laughs> <laughs> Wow, that was a terrible <laughs> roll. Oh. Six. If she gets a five, it's alive. Yep, it's alive. No, uh, <laughs> I'm just gonna take some of these. <laughs> no, run for you. <laughs> no, run <laughs> <laughs> for you. <laughs> I would see it never go to you. Oh, oh I got one. one. <laughs> Very good. <laughs> you get one. No, I'm cursed. I'm not gonna get one. She oh, gets she gets one. another one. And another one. Damn. And I get another and one. You get another oh. one. <laughs> I've got none of these free handouts. <laughs> I've got like three for the whole play. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> are... You've got 50 comrades. We have us. <laughs> All right, guys. Now hand back your cards. I just got to keep it alive. <laughs> okay, okay, I'm going to shoot again. So it gets plus eight to this. That is a hit. There's a raise. Oh yeah, it's just dropping everything. Because of the drop, yep. So it's this plus six damage. And then 12, 12, 18. Okay, here we go. Is that one wound or two wounds? It's one there? wound. Okay, so you need a seven. Nope. Oh, you got it. Alright. Who's getting these free bennies? You're Damn getting these. <laughs> Damn it! Oh, so it's got one. Yeah. 
<laughs> All right, you guys are sitting there like mountains. <laughs> redo any role you want. Just keep doing it. I'll just keep redoing it. <laughs> All right, and this is its turn. It just burrows back into the ground. Damn, I was gonna like throw the metal rod through its mouth and kill it. <laughs> All right. Well, you three have well, a, have a round to prepare. I guess there's. Do I need to roll stealth again, even though it's going back into the ground? Um. Yes. Well, is this about a metal rod? I picked up a metal rod back here, and I was gonna like shove it through its mouth into its brain and kill it. Five. Um. I'll, I'll spend, uh, actually, <laughs> just give her. A yeah, I'll just give it. Give it away. That's gonna be you. <laughs> <laughs> Somehow, it's just so used to handing them out to me. Ten. Ten? Yep. Alright. Nope. Oh. And like a gambling man in a casino, he goes all in. <laughs> yeah, I'll just call it there. Alright. So, you are no longer stealthed as the goblin man. Oh, a goblin! <laughs> oh, that was like your teddy bear's back! <laughs> you said you found a rod? It might be useful yeah. or something. Let me have a look at it. Well, first, um, MacArthur's gotta go. Yeah, I, oh, yeah, I can't really seen. go anywhere, so. Um, <laughs> yeah, that's <laughs> true. Hold me action! You, you <laughs> could go through and then, like, just damage your armor. <laughs> you could throw a can. I got one turn. What do you mean, throw a can? I don't have any cans! <laughs> you could throw a can down in this hole here. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not sending one of my men on a suicide mission! Wait, what do I do when I hold my action? Uh, you just, just flip your card over. Then you can basically just go yeah. at any time. And, and don't hand it back to me when I say hand back your cards. <laughs> So, now it would actually be Johnson's turn. You could actually go to her. Yeah, I have the pace for it. Six, seven. So, can I have a look at this rod? Yeah. Yeah. Uh, give, do you have knowledge technology? Yes, I do. Would you roll it for me? Yes, I can. I got fives. Just across the board. Cool. It is... It's a beacon. You know that it's some kind of a beacon. It looks like a beacon for study. Some kind of a study type of beacon. Is it active? No, it's actually disabled. Uh, you can also it's notice... Nice to say. Actually, you don't notice. You don't notice that. That's the raise portion <laughs> that I have uh, written okay. down. Um, you could, you could uh, easily... You know exactly what the problem is on this thing. You could try and repair it. I'll give it a go. See what happens. Finding random crap down here. No, watch it just blows up in my hands. Well, it's in my hands right now. Unless you're not giving it to me. Blows up in your face. <laughs> 14. Alright, you got it. Um, the thing lights up. And, uh... Yeah. We have a source of light. It, it, just, it just lights up for now. For now. I got a torch. <laughs> yeah. And, uh... Hmm. How am I going to do this? I'll do a 50-50 roll. Um, immediately after you turn it on, the worm kind of emerges here with, uh, with a loud screech. And it looks like it's in pain from this beacon now that it is on. Now can I stabby stabby? Yeah, now you can stabby stabby. <laughs> whippy whippy. Whippy yeah. whippy. Whippy good. How are you gonna hike it over there? You can well, move through it. You just yeah, have... there's not too much acid over here. I can like jump across. You just don't fall in the hole. <laughs> well, you you would you would have to make an agility check, and uh, if you fail the agility check, that's when your armor would be damaged. And it's really just a base agility roll. You got bennies. You got yeah. bennies. Got bennies. Oh. Yeah, you got it. Okay. So, I'm like right here. Yep. Staring this thing down. Excuse me, you're staring this thing down. 
And, uh, yeah. Oh, wait, I stole, I took the thing back. Oh, you took it back? Yeah, okay. I took it back. Fine. And I'm what? just gonna, like, swing at it. Just, like, hit it with the beacon. Alright, yeah. Roll your fighting. What? When did this happen? <laughs> I'm tinkering with it. As soon as it lights <laughs> like, up, she just mine. takes it. <laughs> yeah. Five. Five. That is going to be a hit. Yay! So what? What would be that that damage? Weapon? Yeah. Yeah, that would be. It'd be the same as your whip. Okay. Because it's um, improvised weapons are usually a D, strength plus D four. Gotcha. Four. Four. <laughs> okay then. <laughs> just kind of glances off. Yeah, you just go boom. <laughs> Kind of, kind of like to the same effect as a dog, or as like a person hitting a dog with like one of those uh, paper toweling rolls. Man, uh, I should have rolled intimidation. Or, Just be like, or like Fuck! yeah, <laughs> yeah. I'll put that there. Um, I'm gonna die. Yeah, he was gonna emerge next turn, but because of that, he uh, kind of, kind of went up a bit too early. All right, so hand in your cards. Actually, MacArthur's on hold. You yeah. could go right now if you want. Shoot him. Please. Shoot yeah. Him. Sure. Yeah. Plus one. Ba -da 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 -da. That's beautiful. Thank you. I'm the voice of a generation. People <laughs> told me. <laughs> well, he's got a raise. He's got a raise on his attack. Roll your damage. And the D six at AP two. Fifteen. Fifteen. That is going to... AP2. AP2. So that is actually... That's going to just barely be enough to kill it. Oh! He did. And it goes... <laughs> and just kind of slumps game. over right here. <laughs> <laughs> so, the end of that round. These things go away. And... MacArthur is able to uh, move once more. Yeah. <laughs> and then this right here, um, that goes away in about 12 ish seconds. Stops glowing a weird green color. Yeah. Well, this time it didn't really glow a weird green color. Because there weren't any living oozes in it. <laughs> yeah. <sighs> Alright, so you have. This thing right here. And uh, at this point, now that the battle's over with and you got kind of a clear head now, you can tell that it's a mausoleum. Or at least uh, the underground part of a mausoleum. There are some uh, sort of shells where dead bodies would be, some caskets. Yeah, so that basically leads into a mausoleum. Also, there are holes here. Yes. <laughs> That's what those black circles are. <laughs> All right. So I say we just kind of go in. Yeah. Go in. And how big are these scales on this thing? Um. Pretty big. <laughs> we'll just say they're pretty big. Because <laughs> I want to try and get some off of it. Okay. Um. It has quite a bit of a grip on it. Uh, I mean, you could potentially do that, but it would take you about a half hour to just carve right into it, because it's surprisingly, like, even though it's a baby, it is still surprisingly <laughs> durable. It was a baby. It was a baby. We killed a baby. You guys okay if I get these? Because these scales are really tough. Make good armor. Go for it. I say this is a good ending spot because I work at 6 tomorrow morning. We are almost done, actually. Okay. So we have that mausoleum over there. Yes, I say that you can have them. To the mausoleum yes. I go! There will be some place. payment for your goods <laughs> yes, and yes, services. Yes, yes, yes. I'm inspecting so the mausoleum. So we're spending a half hour speak. to let me get some of these things. Okay. And then sure. to the mausoleum. Yeah, so what are you guys, what are you three doing in that half hour? Uh, I'm inspecting this mausoleum. Chilling. Right Can I do Just some wither? Can I take your card? Do you have wither? How many power points? Can points you give me now? some wither? Um, that's not something I have to I'll carry say around. you gain one. Oh my god. What am I going to do without wither? <laughs> 
explode. I don't um, know what happens. Take penalties. <laughs> take some take some levels of fatigue, I think. Alright, so... Can I eat one of his cans? <laughs> You'd have to swipe it. You'd have to swipe it! Nah. <laughs> get Willis. You've already killed get, one. Can I eat Willis? <laughs> so... I guess uh, after this long amount of time, like a half an hour, you guys would probably realize there are no dead bodies in this mausoleum, and a lot of the uh, items within this mausoleum have been taken. Uh-oh. Somebody looted it. Thieving zombies! What did I just hear about? Thieving bombies? <laughs> <laughs> Never mind! You killed bombies, Mom! Thieving <laughs> <Easy> bombies? <laughs> Forget I said it! March of the Zumbinis? What? Raging <laughs> Crabs? Randall Cobb? <laughs> and I guess half hour later, you get three scales. Three scales, I'll take it. And then we eat our dinner off of it. Yeah, and then you eat it. <laughs> Oh my gosh. No, but you break your teeth is there, on it. Is there no, any other we eat the dinner way to go? Or is it just... Yeah, um, there, is a, there is a set of stairs that lead up and out of it. And uh, the door does appear to be open. I say well, we go up the up stairs there. because this guy is a lousy Witherroot dealer. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Let's leave him behind. Yeah, I'm going up those stairs. Yeah, let's go up I the stairs. I got something else if you want it. <laughs> no, 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 no. One addiction is bad enough, yeah. okay? How, how does that work? Can I try something else and will that satisfy my, my wither? That's not how it works. <laughs> but you just, just take, on, enough to know you just that. take on another addiction. <laughs> is he There's... smart enough to know that, though? Uh, that's his call. <laughs> cigarettes in the game, and they don't do anything. If you smoke them, you just have a chance to get addicted. Yeah. yeah. Anyway, that's... <laughs> Is that pretty much how real life is? You just waste your <laughs> Yeah, that's yeah, yeah. so weird. <laughs> All right. So, yeah, you uh, go outside of the mausoleum, and you see that a lot of the graves appear to be dug up. Zombies! <laughs> <laughs> Zombie! <laughs> and, uh, yeah, at this point, you pretty much figure it's time to just leave behind this craziness. We're done. <laughs> I'm noping the hell out of here. <laughs> Wait, so we're up in the open air right now? Yes. Yeah, you're outside. Oh, that took a while. Yeah. Finally out of this cave. And uh, you figure maybe it's time we should just go back to Sanctuary. Screw rumors. I Screw agree. rumors. Let's go. Well, now, I've lived in this abandoned city for quite some time, and I think me and my army are ready to move on. <laughs> all right, buddy. I'm coming buddy, with him, coming and you're with all us. enlisted. <laughs> <laughs> all right, well, thank you guys for joining me in this heck of an adventure. It's only the beginning. And as for you guys out there, uh, we are a small channel. Be sure to like, comment, and subscribe. Uh, tell us what we can do to improve. Tell us what you liked, what you didn't like. And, uh, yeah, definitely hope you guys enjoyed this. We will see you next time. Bye. Yes. <laughs> we need like some sort of